Matthew here from MiniWarGaming.com with Scarry from Scardcast, bringing another Age of Sigmar battle report. This one with the new Daughters of Cain battle tome versus the Auric War Clan's Cruel Boys. We play and call it work. MiniWarGaming's Age of Sigmar battle report. So today I'm running the new Daughters of Cain Battle Tome. I'm running Zainthar Kai as my cult, basically, which means my snakes become battle line, and their trait is whenever my snakes die in combat, oh, and die, they get to fight, basically, when they die, which is pretty cool. I'm running a Hyperic Guard, one of the new core battalions from the Daughters of Cain book, which is Marathi. Then I have a uh, Bloodrack Medusa as well as uh, one of the leaders, and then two units of snakes. I have a unit of Blood Sisters and a unit of Blood Stalkers as well. Then I'm running a Hunters of the Heartland um, Battalion as well, with both of my units of Heart Renders, two units of five Heart Renders, and a reinforced unit of Witch Elves, a big unit of 20. I do have a Slaughter Queen and a, to round it all down, I have the Bloodrack Viper, which is an endless spell that I absolutely love, and the Heart of Fury. We're going to try out this invocation and see how it works, allowing units within 12 or wholly within 12 to have minus one damage when doing damage to them, which is going to be really cool. Okay, other than that, I've got Marathi. Well, Marathi is Marathi. So let's uh, dive in and see how many we can murder in the name of Cain. And for my cruel boys, I will be playing the big yellers again, but not because I want to do lots of crossbows, there won't be one unit of them, but because I just don't want to have to bring three units of gut rippers uh, as a default. I, so one of my battle line will be the crossbows instead. It will allow them to shoot a little further and have a reroll in the first turn. I'm going to try out the kill a boss and corpse rip a vulture for the first time. I did bring Gobsprack last time, but this is the non-character version, which works actually quite differently. The vulture itself is still pretty powerful. But the guy on top, he can actually issue the same command ability for a second time, as long as he's the one issuing it the second time. And then we also have a Snatch a Boss on Sludge Raker Beast. And we have two Swamp Kala Shamans with their pot grots. For my battle line, I've got a reinforced unit of Gut Rippers, so 20 of them. And then a regular unit of Gut, gut Rippers, so 10 of them. And then a doubly reinforced unit of Man Skewer Bolt Boys. So I just want to be able to do some shooting. And, well, these guys can do some shooting, obviously. And then for my other, I've got four units of 10 Hobgrot Slitters. I love these guys. They're just great blockers, and they can actually deal some damage. And they're super cheap. This is all a part of a Warlord Core Battalion and a Hunters of the Heartlands Core Battalion for my whole army. And that's my 2,000 points of Cruel Boys. Today we'll be playing Power in Numbers, a battle plan from Pitch Battles 2021. This one has us deploying on the long table edges, and there are six objectives, three bordering each territory. Now, in order to get victory points, you have your normal battle tactics and grand strategies, but you can also destroy objectives, any number of them that you can control, in fact, at the end of your turn, starting in the second battle round. However, the number of victory points you get depends on how long you've controlled that objective for without being interrupted. If it's just one turn, you get one point. If you've controlled it for two of your turns without any interruptions, you get two points. Three turns, four points. For the entire battle, so five turns, not four, you get eight victory points. So obviously you want to wait, but not wait too long. Whoever has the most victory points is the winner. We'll be playing on this table. The mat is from GameMat.eu. And most of the terrain is actually Games Workshop terrain, either Warcry or just Age of Sigma or Warhammer Fantasy stuff from yonder years. And we got some cool spires that uh, Greenleaf Terrain actually made for us for a campaign. So we are all ready to go. Don't forget, there's over 50 companies that offer discounts to our Silver Vault members. You can check that out at miniwargaming.com slash silver discount. Also, we'd love to have more guests. So I don't have to keep playing Scary. I'm just kidding. I like playing Scary. <laughs> I'm going to go sit in yeah, the corner. Yeah, that's right. Go over there. <laughs> I'll roll your dice. Uh, go to miniwargaming.com slash challenge. And challenge Matthew. Or maybe you can teach him a thing or two about rules. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Smack talk has begun. <laughs> and we are deployed. Scar is able to deploy faster because he had eight or nine drops and I had 11. And so you will be dictating who goes first. There's, uh, I, I'm not super happy with how I deployed. I kind of, but at the same time, I'm not quite sure. It depends on who goes first. 
because I wanted my crossbows to be more central, but I placed these guys down first and realized that afterwards. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I, I just, it, your bows could also just kill stuff. You could send that endless spell and just eat models because you can put it so far forward now, so maybe it's not so horrible. I don't know. We'll find out. And then you've just kind of got a standard. Yeah, I've got my well. uh, Slaughter Sisters or my Blood Sisters. I've got my Marathi, Little Marathi, the Stalkers, my Blood Rack Medusa, big unit of reinforced uh, witches, and then the Slaughter Queen back here as well. And, and then, then in the air? In the air, we've got two units of Heart Renders. Uh, they, of course, drop down. They're really useful for like um, battle tactics and stuff and screening and whatnot. So oh, and just really any well. mission where you're trying to nab yeah. back objectives, exactly. right? Exactly. It's going to force mm -hmm. me to keep some guys left. Thankfully, I got lots of Hobgrats. That's their job is to basically spread out, guys. <laughs> Make sure there's no ground to cover that they can land on. <laughs> that usually is the case. Now, you have a couple of things you need to do before I choose yes. who goes first. So, my dirty trick happens after you choose who goes first, but right. my command trait, which I'm probably not even going to use because I don't even know what to do. Uh, no, I do, I do know what I'm going to do with it, actually. My command trait that I gave him is a um, cunning one or sneaky one, I can't remember. And that is I can remove a Cruel Boys unit mm -hmm. and place it anywhere on the table more than 9 inches from enemies. Yep. So that's pretty cool. So I'm going to do that. I'm probably going to grab one of the Hobgrot Slittas and use them to, to, to screen up here. Because I know you can send that snake across and I don't care if you eat Hobgrots. <laughs> eat the Hobgrots, man. They're yours. Ah, what did the Viper Snake ever do to you yet? Yeah, exactly. Or I might use it to screen the crossbows, but give me two seconds to figure that out. So I did grab the Hobgrot Slittas, which were over here, which are pretty useless. Like, they were just going to run out this way anyways. And I dropped them down here. And yes, this isn't coherency, because this model is within an inch of two other models, because their bases are really small. They're so smaller be, than an inch bases. Yeah, yeah, just, just they're like 25 millimeter, which 25.4 millimeters Correct. would be an inch. So that is legal. This is legal. I'm just saying this because, you know, some people get that wrong. And that's okay. I get it wrong sometimes, too. And uh, so that they're there. I made sure not to leave enough space for his endless spell to be able to get past them. So basically, sorry guys. You don't want me to eat two wound models. So I want, want you to eat, eat Hobgrats. Hobgrats. Yeah, you can eat three of them automatically, basically. Yep. So that's kind of, unless it says one's always fail, I'm not sure. Nope. Okay, so at this point, you choose who goes first, and then I get to choose a dirty trick. I will let you go first. Okay. And then, uh, normally, I've been forced to go first. I kind of like the idea of setting up screens and whatnot, but in this mission, I feel that going first um i what the plan is i want to go second so that you go first i potentially do turn one turn two and then if i win the roll for turn three i can give you the turn three to then me control who takes the objectives off so that's like because i want to be able to take one of yours away yeah and like, that could be and game to help right for, the, for the mission so we'll see we'll, we'll see. see okay yeah. well let me look at my dirty tricks and we'll see what we're going to do I kind of want to do the one that uh, sabotages objectives and, ter and terrain, possibly do more to wounds to you, but I think I'm going to go, I'm going to play it safe, mm -hmm. and I'm going to make a noisy racket. So basically, I partied all last night and kept you awake. Ooh, that's so not, you're tired. That's not fun. You're all drinking your morning coffee. Look at my hair. My <laughs> hair totally reflects what's going on right now. <laughs> so your whole army's minus one to wound for the first battle round until you're fully awake. Shooting and combat? Everything. Ooh, Just okay. minus one to wound. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's why it's good for hmm. anything that anybody I like can shoot that. me. I like that, and I don't like it at the same time. I kept you up, all right? That's not cool. That's just, you know, banging those drums? Yeah, exactly. Just like some sort of weird terror tactics. Well, that's <laughs> why we can't have any nice things, Matthew. <laughs> that's right. And that's it, so I get to go first now. Okay, so let's do my hero phase. Uh, my battle tactic should be pretty straightforward. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I think this is the turn I'll, I'll do the ferocious advance. Three things running. Okay, so, uh, so, what's the rend on, on these guys? Uh, just minus one. Minus but they, it's all about mortal wounds in my army. Okay. So, if, is it sixes to hit do mortals normally? Okay. But you'll see in a second that it could be fives as well. Nice. And sixes could do more mortals. Yeah. The basic rule for my whole army, except the Hobgrots, because they're not uh, Oryx, and uh, not usually the monsters, but these monsters actually get it because mm -hmm. they're special. Is that if I roll a six to hit, it does mortal wounds equal to the damage characteristic instead of anything else, and it just nice. stops. Is that in combat and shooting? Everything. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Uh, I have ways to boost that though. Anybody wholly within 12 of him does an extra mortal wound on the six. Yep. The swamp pot, uh, the swamp called the shamans can hand out poison, which I will do correctly. So to a unit within three, wholly within 12, not in combat. Well, he's yep. not in combat. And now it happens on fives. And so, but the sixes still only do the extra mortal wound near him, even if the fives are working. Nice. So that's what my army basically does. So that, that's, that's all they care about. And if, if I don't really care about rend. So in my hero phase, my battle tactic will be run, 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 and I will just choose, I don't know, 
Hobgratz, Hobgratz, and then Gut Rippers, because then they'll just kind of run up together. Yep. And then for my heroic action, I don't really have anything super cool to do, so we're just going to go for an extra command point, which I achieve. I'll put it on my Killer Boss, because he's got the special ability to do the same command mm -hmm. ability for a second time. So if I want to like run two things, I could do that, or ah, it only lasts my turn anyway, so we'll see. I'll also go for an inspiring speech on Little Marathi. Oh, no extra command point for you. not inspired today. No, not today. But I did. Yeah, you, you have three, three because yeah. you're going second. Uh, and then I will hand out some poison so the, the Swamp Caller Shamans can do it instead of casting spells to a unit within three, holy within 12. So I'm going to give it to, this Swamp Caller Shaman will give it to the crossbows, obviously. And this one will give it to the gut rippers, also obviously, right now. I think it still works on these guys, but they'll get more use of it. I did give an arcane tome to my killer boss, and he knows Choking Mist, which is to place, I, I choose a point within 24 and units within six can't run, and units within six get minus one attack. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not going to be super effective this turn because I can maybe hit your archers, but they're probably not going to want to run anyways. So I need a seven to cast it. So, okay, this is the turn I didn't care as much. It's really nice to kind of nick defensively as well when you come to charge me and you're going to get minus one attack. But I can also shut down, like, Ferocious Advance. Uh, ima if I, imagine if I was further forward and I could drop it, like, right there, and all of a sudden yeah. all these units. The archers Colorado are probably... Whatever, yeah. yeah, the archers are probably not going to want to run anyways because they're going to shoot. Yeah. But it does limit your options. So that's all of my spells. And that's my hero phase. Yep, that's my hero phase. Into my movement phase, I am just going to do before and after because this is pretty straightforward. Um, I may... I don't, I don't think I'll hand it. Well, let's see what I do. You know, I'm just going to before and after. Here's the before. <laughs> And there is the after. So we got Hobgratz just kind of running up the one flank, just to kind of be annoying. Others forming a party circle. We we're making sure that he can't deep strike anywhere in the back with his mm -hmm. uh, with mm -hmm. his winged creatures. Yep. And then just running up the middle, ferociously advancing. Look at our tactics. I wish I had a unit of Hobgratz right here, though. Um, in hindsight, I kind of wish that one of the ones over there was right here, and they could have run over. But the train is kind of in. You way. know what they say about hindsight, Matthew? Um, it's twenty twenty. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Some words of wisdom there. <laughs> All right, let's go to the shooting, where we're going to fire most of these guys across at your little snakes. No, don't shoot them. What uh, have they ever done to you? But what I'm going to do, actually, is have a couple of them fire at Marathi. Don't I can, do that I can only either. do three wounds per turn, right? For player turns. So i got to start working on that 12 you, wounds. If you don't, it's going to be very hard to bring it down. Yeah, so. When you play against Marathi, you need to target Marathi as quickly and as often as possible yeah. with as many things as you can because it takes you four turns to kill her. For player turns. For yeah. player turns. So two battle rounds if you start right away. Exactly. Yeah. And she can do some work. So I'm thinking three of them might be enough to get, because you have a six up ward on her? Six up ward right now, okay. on the whole arm. So I'm going to basically say that that's like a, I need to do like four mortal wounds to her. So three of them, because fives will do two mortal wounds and sixes will do, oh no, they're only one shot each. Yuck, mm -hmm. but I do get real one reroll. So maybe I just focus on her. Forget about the Blood Sisters for now. Yeah, so you know what? I will just fire. This one is too far away to fire at anybody. So these eight, um, except for this one. This one, was the angle wasn't good. So this one will fire at the Blood Sisters. Yep. And then seven of them will fire at Marathi. And okay. I'm going to roll nothing but sixes and be like, oh. <laughs> Let's do the one boring one. Ah, uh, no, no. I got to see the Marathi, how Marathi works out first. Because I got one reroll because it's the first turn and I'm big yellers. So I got seven there. So that only on the first battle round? Only first battle round is big yellow. Reroll to hit or reroll? One reroll to hit okay. per, per unit. unit. Mm -hmm. And it's just in the first battle round. And um, that's only that's big yellers. Okay. The extra range is, is constant. Nice. So is there any negatives to hit Marathi? Nope. OK, so we're looking at twos to hit. Yep. And fives will do two mortal wounds. Sixes will do three mortal wounds. Okay. This feels like overkill, but we'll see. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, OK, it's not horrible. So let's just roll your Six words before I, before I worry about any of those. Six mortal wounds, and there. We did our she first three. three. Oh, that's such, such overkill. <laughs> I would have destroyed that unit of Blood Sisters. She has nine remaining. Okay, so I saved the reroll then. So we're going to have the other one fire at the Blood Sisters. So yep. single shot on twos. Okay, that's two mortal wounds. I'll stop there. Cool. Sixes. And the sixes to ignore. Nope. You kill a Blood Sister. Woo! Blip. All right. Well, that's my turn. I'm, not, I'm assuming one's not enough to make them really care about morale. They're, they're bravery eight now. Okay. So they're pretty decent bravery. All right, so... Uh, you get your battle tactic. I do. You I, get uh, zero primary because you didn't yeah, burn any of your objectives. Well, you I can't on the first turn. Yet. So it's just two points to... For me. Now, I should point out one thing I forgot to say in the about the mission mm -hmm. is that battle line units, 
if they're holding an objective, then only battle line units can contest the objective. It's mm -hmm. kind of like 40K's objective secured, yep. is this mission specifically. So I should, that, that might come up, we'll see. Hobgrats are not battle line. Cool. And so we'll see how that happens. Yeah, so two nothing for me. Uh, that's all the time we got. So, <laughs> <laughs> crew boys, with the thanks a lot for watching, everyone. <laughs> Happy war gaming. <laughs> Let's go to your turn. Okay, so battle tactic will be aggressive expansion. So I'm going to hold two objectives. You did it! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> that are the tactic outside of my deployment zone. Excellent. Uh, or not wholly within, which is technically this, which we were talking about earlier. Hold on. Can you heroic recovery, Marathi? I cannot. You can't? No. Oh, she, good. The wounds that she takes cannot be healed in any way. Oh, good. Yes. I just all of a sudden, I'm like, oh, no, wait. I don't want to shoot her anymore. Can I just kill the Blood Sisters? No. Please. No, no, no. They, uh... Okay, good. They, you do wounds, it sticks. Good, uh, that's good, good, usually good, good, good. how it works with her. Okay, so with that, let's do some spelly spells. I'm going to go ahead and the Blood... Uh, oh, hold on. What's your heroic action? Oh, my heroic action will be Marathi will attempt to get a command point. Nope. Not again. So Not today. my heroic action... Let me double check how much... Unbinding I have. I'm gonna go for an extra command point. Okay. On my general, four plus. Big guy. Good. I got it with a four. Nice. I'm gonna try and uh, bring out the snake. <laughs> the snake that eats things. That's right. Four. I need a seven to cast oh. it. You have no pluses or negatives. Okay, well, if there's a time to unbind, it is now, because you just got exactly what you needed. I did. So I need to roll eight or higher. That I will count this as the further away. I don't, doesn't matter. They're in written range to unbind yep. everywhere. So eight or higher. Okay. Four is not eight, nor higher. You, can you re-roll it or anything? Nope, I have no way to re-roll it. Hooray! I'm just regular wizards over Let's here. Let's go snake to snake. Can go within 18 and then can move nine. So I'm really excited about that. In here, no. It does not, but I can go up here. Good, good. I don't know if it flies though. So <laughs> I'm like, maybe... what are you doing? What are you doing, Scary? Man, I don't... Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to block your own guys is what you're doing. No, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, the 18 inches on this is really cool. I'm really like, actually, if I bring it like this way here, I could move it nine this way. Oh, I like that. And then eat them. Because <laughs> you're going to roll three dice, <laughs> and um, every, every roll that's equal to or higher than their wounds characteristic just removes a model. Correct. Eating them, right? But it, the biggest thing here is I need to put it in a place where now I'm threatening your heroes because right. it's very good at eating five or six wounded. Well, they're, yeah, they're six wounded heroes. Correct. So if I roll any. You're three dice. Correct. So any so three dice. Now, does the little dude count as a model too? No. No. Okay. So but he, he, count, he does count as part of the unit. So okay. he's not a marker. So if you get within an inch of him, you still you can still do it. Right, but if but I you would, still you still just eat the guy. I eat the main guy. Yes. Okay. okay. Yeah. Even so if I you're need not to roll a six on the three dice, but it's one of the best ways to get rid of like heroes and characters. Oh, three dice for a six is terrifying. Yeah, it's really good. I love my I love my blood rack viper oh, so much. Oh, that's cool. It is super cool. Yeah. Attempt to bring out my heart totem. So this is a invocation. That's right. What do you need to roll? Uh, so it's a three plus. Three plus. Yeah. So it and comes I out. cannot unbind that. Okay. Because you're a priest and that magic is not magic that I can somehow dispel. It comes out within 12. And then every unit that's wholly within 12 of this will um, will get minus one damage. And, when uh, I hit them, yeah. Correct. And then the blood, the witches... Now is it, but it's while they're with holy within 12, right? Correct. Okay. Correct. Yeah, yeah. So I have to stay with holy within 12 or whatever. So it's just going to go there. Or do I want to put it like up here? I was going to say, because you were measuring and pulling it back. But you probably want to put it as far forward as possible. Yeah. I just want to make sure that these blood sisters are holy within 12, but I also want to make sure that these... Oh, they can always move a bit. In I want to make days. sure that these sisters can move up and stay within 12 yeah. while they do attacks and stuff. To me. Uh, the Soldier Queen is going to do Dance of Death, which is she has an artifact that allows me to do two invocations. So Dance of Death will give uh, the Fight First ability to the unit of witches. Very cool. Which is very powerful. What do you need for it? A uh, three plus. Okay. So I can't stop off. that because it's a priest. Oh! So they have the fight first, which is really good because it lasts well, a little They run and here, charge too. And right? they can run and charge, which is fantastic. So I can get them stuck in, and even if you charge them, they get to fight you. Yeah. So I'm really excited to try them out. Big block of them, which is going to be fun. Okay, now Marathi gets to do some spells. I'm going to try Mind Razor. I need an eight. Oh, I get it. What does it do? So Mind Razor is a spell that it's a 18 inches, so I pick a door as a cane unit. Holy within range, I improve the rend of their melee weapons by one. In addition, when they charge, they get plus one damage as well. Oh, golly. <laughs> Who are you going to give that to? Oh, gonna, yeah. Unless uh, you want to try and unbind it. I definitely should. And yet, I, 
I only have one more unbinding. You probably have nastier stuff. I have two more spells. Yeah, I'll just not care and try to unbind them. Okay. A nine, pl nine plus. Will you stop nope. it? Nope. So these doors of cane are oh. very, very killy. Yeah, no kidding. Very killy. Mind right. So, okay. What else he got? Okay, two Is more this going to be a one turn game? You're going to charge for it and delete my army? <laughs> if I double turn you, it'll be, it'll that, be interesting. That'd be kind of, I, I'm curious um, to see. I kind of want to see you do that. Uh, well, we'll see how much damage. Normally, I've been on the receiving end of the damage. <laughs> <laughs> so when I've been playing doors of cane, so it feels interesting to be in the position to potentially do more damage. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, All right, what else you got? Okay. I'm going to go ahead and do the Black Horror of Ulgu. So it's a casting value of seven. No. Okay. Well, I would have been able to pick any unit within 36 inches. Jeez. And on a one, you take one mortal wound. On a two to three, you take D3. On a four, you take D6 mortal wounds. Cool. So it's, a, it's one of my favorites. It's just spells. a mortal wound dealing spell. Yeah, it's, but it's a sniping mortal 36 wound. 36 inches, so oh, yeah, it's that's fantastic. pretty high. I'm going to go ahead and do Pit of Shades. Uh, the only thing within 18 is this little unit of uh, hobgoblins. hobgoblins. I need a 6. Goes off. So I'm going to roll 2d6 and subtract your move characteristic. 5. Uh, and then the difference is the number of mortal wounds you take. Okay. Okay. So how far okay. would she roll? So yeah. One mortal wound. <laughs> we'll grab it from this side. One falls down the Pit of Shades. Uh. I'm going to use one of my command points now to give worth it, worship through bloodshed command ability in the hero phase i'm going to make my bows shoot okay what's their target going to be um they're just going to shoot into this unit right here what's their rend uh rend one okay uh, i will all out defense there with my free command point eight, four, five, six, actually no not with my free command. they'll, they'll seven, shoot to them eight, and to nine, themselves ten. wait i can't all out defense Never in mind. The, in the hero face. No, no. <laughs> so ten bows hitting on threes and sixes to hit do one mortal wound. In instead addition? Of, instead or instead of, yeah. That's broken. Your sixes do mortal wounds? No. <laughs> Is that how that works? Uh, so broken, man. I know, who, right? Who brings armies like that? I do hit on threes. Normally I would wound on threes, but you're minus one to wound. That's right. So I would be wounding on fours. At Show me lots of threes. Fours at rend one. There's two threes in there. Well, that was just a bad roll overall. Yeah, it's all good. Okay, so four mortal wounds and three minus one rend. I got a six up save against the rend. Yep. So that's seven wounds in total. So it kills three and a half of them. Uh, we'll just kind of pull from the middle ish. I'm not too concerned about keeping you away from me yet. Yep. So one, two, three, and then we'll injure one. End of your hero phase, you get to move the Snicker endless spell. Snake is just going to move up and just get within an inch of these dudes over here. So now you roll three dice, every two plus is a dead model. Correct. And I choose the model, right? It's not yeah, you pick the models. Okay. Now, however, uh, the, I can't kill him because he's got way more than more six than wounds. Six. Yeah. So he's immune to the big snake. However, the snake also is a monster for monsters rampages. So I can stomp or smash to rubble. If you had a faction terrain. Yeah. Which won't work in this case because he's a monster. So and they're hunters. Them. And they're hunters. Correct. So it won't work. It's still pretty cool though. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's kind of like the to know that an endless spell has that. Which I love is that. Cool, I love actually. that. It's yeah. a big snake. Okay. So, so how many two pluses can you roll? Three of them. What a surprise. <laughs> so one. Um, 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 um. Yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, so now I can start to remove models from back here because you've kind of blocked where things can go. It's delicious, I say. I was say. considering like a redeploy this way to kind of block whatever you do, but now that endless spell's in my way. Okay. Movement phase. Movement phase. Uh, just pretty straightforward stuff. I'm just going to move my... Uh, Blood Rack Medusa. Actually, no. Let's move the witches first. I was going to say, be careful. <laughs> this redeploys might ruin gonna your strategy. I'm going to use the. I'm going to use a command point to auto run them six. Auto go six, okay. and that means they just move yeah. twelve. Okay. Yeah, I would have totally redeployed four. Good thing I stopped and just gummed you up a bit. And then think uh, thinked for <laughs> think it thinked for just like two seconds uh, to make sure that that was that was gonna that was gonna work. Indeed. Yeah, Scari is moving up there. He has committed that he's leaving this front. So as he puts the rest of his models, I will issue a redeploy on these Hobgrats. I don't yeah. want him to be able to really get to this objective. So they're going to move back what an inch. Mean? Yeah, that's what happens. Where's Gobsprack when you did him? Weren't you, weren't you, you were talking about that earlier, weren't yeah, you? Yeah, that I don't like redeploy because I don't like that it's D6. I'd rather it be D3 plus 3, to be honest. Yeah. Or half your move characteristic rounded up or something like that. However, it is nice that you get to use it, though. Right? Yeah, yeah. Not when it's a 1, though. That was a waste of command point. Uh, Blood Rack Medusa is just going to jump up eight inches. Jump up, jump up, and jump down. Now she's got a really cool uh, thing where she gets to stare at you and murder models and yeah. do mortals. So yeah, no I'm way. excited to try that. Good, goodbye, Gut Rippers. <laughs> I'm going to have my Killer Boss issue redeploy because he can issue the same command ability that's been done. <clears throat> I'm going to issue it onto these Hobgrats right here. 
Okay. So that'll use his special command point that he generated, and they're gonna move. <gasps> Three, that's like triple what I just did. <laughs> so they're coming laterally this way because we want to base, and then we're gonna, well, we're gonna stay three inches away as per the rules, because rules are a thing, you know? Rules dictate what's fun, Matthew, and I think we've discussed this many a time. I'm gonna bring these back a bit and tuck them like <clears> this. <throat> mm -hmm. The idea is just to make, I don't know, you're just gonna snipe them anyways. But it's, I wanted to show off that he could do the same command ability. Twice. Yeah. A slaughter queen is going to run. Well, she's fast. Uh, jump she on that objective. Go three. And there's a door there. <laughs> yeah, good thing. Bah. Get the objective. He's just gonna go over here and just hide behind over here. Right. Uh, yeah, let's, you know what? I wanna have some fun with Marathi before she dies. Uh, Cause those little mm. bows are really- Now I remember that you're gonna do that. <laughs> My brain's like, wait, no, I was supposed to re do the replay on him and have him turn. <laughs> So he would be a screen for the crossbows, which is a really weird thing to do with your sludge raker, but mm -hmm, mm -hmm. at this point I kind of wanted. So that was a, a, a biffed moment on my end because I'd forgotten that I wanted to save her for that. I can't do a third redeploy, unfortunately. Yo, I want- Blood Sisters back there. They're just gonna move within 18 of my general. Uh, and because then hold then, that objective. Yeah, they're gonna hold the objective. Actually, I'm gonna get a little bit more aggressive, I think, like this. Just yeah, force but it then all to... my units will be able to get to you. Sure. <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot dead after this. After this um, okay. okay. Uh, Shooting. Snakes firing again? No, no, they're gonna move. They're gonna oh, they're move. Gonna, okay, I am sorry. gonna. I'm gonna get aggressive. I think. Okay. I'm just gonna, uh, yeah, they're just gonna move up. Might as well get involved. You know, they. If I die in combat, they get to fight again anyway. So because of my. Even as, is it again? It's not like as long as they haven't already fought. Correct. Okay. It's just if they if you kill them, they fight. That's just how that That's works. That's cool. And then Especially if they manage to. 18 inches. Marath little Marathi is going to run. She goes pretty decent. So she's going to go up this way and make sure that she's in range to cast the fight twice or shoot twice uh, somewhere if she needs to, potentially. So I'm going to actually move her probably up to here. Okay. Okay, so shooting. I'm just going to go ahead and do the blood rack. Medusa is going to pick this unit of hobgoblins. And hub gruts. I'm, hub gruts, sorry. And I'm going to just stare at them. And so you roll die for every model within 12, and on a what? They take on a, a five, they will take a mortal. So as I stare them down, there's turn nine, to stone. There are nine models remaining in the unit. And, and you turn I three of them to three stone. Three of them down. Well, I don't have to worry about coherency. <laughs> Those go you, and you, and you, I guess. Cool. So the Blood Sisters are going to shoot. I'm going to shoot. Um, half of them at the hobgrots, and I'm gonna shoot half of them at the other hobgrots over here. What's their bravery, by the way? Probably like five or oh, six. Oh, but they don't care. If they're close to him, they can only ever, one of them can only run. I have to double right? check. I think it's any cruel boys, only one will run. Okay. So I but do get- Either way, it's like, a, I think it's bravery five up to six with their banner. Yeah. Uh, so that's special? what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm just going to, I think I'm gonna do half and half. Um, and I'm going to all-out attack with my... I'm not all-out defending this. Okay. This is not much point. And actually only bravery four up to five, but okay. not that it matters. Cause... So I'm going to do... This is into the six-strong unit. So the one... In front. In front. Okay, so twos. So that'd be two mortals. And then your minus one to wound. And then fours, because of the minus one to wound. And that would be... Three at rend one. Three more at rend one. So five die. Yep. Well, and not much I can do to screen, so I'll just keep the leader there. Maybe he'll surprise you and kill a guy. Here's okay, it. so 10 more shots into the other Hobgoblin unit. Hitting on twos. So why do they hit on twos? Because you all out attack. All out attack, okay. yeah. No they sixes though. Threes. No sixes this time, but fours. Uh, so that's just six, six. more dead. Gonna right. clear out some of that chaff. Yeah, and I think I'm gonna still pull from the back just to force you to fight them yep. a little bit more than the gut rippers. I'll try to do every little thing I can to get some efficiency here. How many wounds on the... Uh, the swamp guy? Somewhere between 10 and 35. I'll double check. Yeah, they're actually both 14 wounds of the four up save. He just looks bigger because of his wings. But they're actually roughly the same size. Uh, Marathi's actually going to stare at the, uh, at the bows. So she's going to shoot the bows. How does, how does that work? It's a 2 plus, 2 plus, rend 3, d6 damage. So 2 plus, 3 plus. 2 plus, 3 plus, yeah. So she's going to stare at them. Does she hit? She does. Does she wound? She does. And it's minus three rend? Minus three. Well, I don't get a save there. D6, D6 damage. D6 damage on that. That kills one of them. Uh, I'll pull from the back at this point. Shoot. Well, that's all I have for shooting. What's your charge? Well, I'm gonna send these uh, sisters in. Let's go. Bring it. How far they go? Three, a healthy four. Healthy four inches. Mm, 
Well, let's mm -hmm. still get them in to what I need them. Like, they'll go four, so that'd be three and three And they four. fight first, so they, they get to fight, fight and then you can pick something else to fight. Correct, so then they'll pile in and do a whole bunch of fighting. I can't fail the charge, even with a snake eyes, because of, oh no, I can't no, plus. Do you have plus one to charge? Not yet, because it's normally So you could re-roll it and fail, but not likely. Not likely. I'm not gonna risk it though. Okay. The four inch <laughs> so charge. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna take the four because they go four and then they can go three. So I'm yeah. gonna be able to fight. You'll be able to kill the hog rats and a few of the gut rippers. Yeah, it'll be good. There's not very many gut rippers left, anyways. You've already killed a lot of them. Yeah. And there's the after their charge. Yep. What's They'll your have next to turn? pile in and do some extra damage. I'm gonna charge with Marathi. Let's see where she can get in. Well, that's a fail. Well, that's definitely why I didn't re-roll that. Uh, <laughs> About a witch charge. So using one of your command points. That's right. I have one command point left, but what does Marathi do? Oh, well, that's going to be seven. better. That's definitely kind of what I wanted anyway. I um, don't know how many models can I keep if I'm within four. I'm going to charge you here. I will unleash hell with whatever can. Yep. You did try to limit as much as possible. And because you're not within three inches, they only get one shot each. Yeah, and that'll be, I believe it's going to be three, four. Four of them. Four of them? Okay, so that'll be five shots <clears throat> because the leader has two shots. And you are unleashing hell? I am. Right okay. Now. So now is it still mortals on fives and sixes yeah. as well? That's why the unleash hell is so nasty. I like it. That's if you get within three, it's extra nasty. I, I just need to get rid of them because they do a lot of damage. So yeah, trying, well, you're about to. I'm you're, trying to get rid of them. You're about to. So, Even but I'm, I'm hoping to do the three wounds to you on your turn, and then on my turn, whoever's surviving, hopefully do more. three more wounds. Yes, exactly. Let's see if I can just kill Marathi. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah. Um, okay, so we're looking at threes to hit instead of twos because of the minus one. Fives yep. do two mortal wounds, sixes do three. Yep. No rerolls here. Okay. Oh, wait, no, we're still in the first battle round. Third so, battle. One, one reroll. Okay, nice. Oh, golly. Well, that's two mortal wounds so far. One okay. reroll. Give me a six. Hey, five mortal wounds nice, total. Very that was clutch. Sixes? Yeah, nope. so we did the three wounds. You did it. I did it, man. You did that it. That was so clutch. Three roll, four misses. Well, I, one tried, six. I tried very hard. You but, did, you did. Uh, it was good. So now, fight phase or combat phase. And they always fight first, and then Marathi can fight. Correct. Nice. Okay, so that's that in there. So now I get to pile in. They basically just have to yeah, make it in. Yeah, and murder my Habgrats and a few gun this as well. Yeah, murder as many as I physically can. She's just going to move around back this way, like that. So I do have to roll for um, uh, the totem. So on a six, it basically goes nuclear. It does not. It just gives me its minus one damage to all of the units. Right now, yes. Uh, if you were attacking with multiple. In charges. this case, it won't matter because all my guys are damaged one. Correct. Now, if it would have rolled a six, though. Um, Does it give you like plus one attack? It would have given me plus one attack as well. And, and then, then it, disappears. And then I remove it. However, uh, the... Um, which elves also have plus one to wound rolls while they're holy within 12 inches of a totem. So they're Golly. also getting so plus one to wound. So that'll make up for my minus one wound Correct. for this turn. So that's actually really neat. I love that. It's a cool little mechanic, this totem. And then if I had a gladiatrix, which we'll be getting in soon, then they even get like extra stuff. But they're also mine razored, which gives them the extra rent and the extra damage. Like they are, yeah, they are they're, they're gonna do work. unit right They are going to do work. Which is going to be fantastic. The only thing that's going to stop them from doing their maximum work is that I still managed to screen them. Yeah, that so little they're, guy they're kill, there. They're killing Hobgrats. And they didn't roll high enough, but I really needed the re-roll because then Marathi was You saw that, yeah. Marathi not getting yeah. in there would have been huge, especially if you didn't double turn me next. <clears throat> Correct, yeah. Okay. We should point out, just before we get going, that this does count as a monster for Monsters Rampage, but you can't do anything to them because they're hunters of the hinterland, and you can't stomp him because... Can I yell at him, though, with Marathi? Oh, yeah, Marathi. Yep, I'm going to yell at you. Okay, ah. well, I'm going to I'm gonna yell at you. <laughs> ah! Oh, no! Ah! 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 Yeah, you're right, we did forget that, because <laughs> yeah, Marathi is a monster. Correct. Um, and so, what was I getting, what was my point? Oh yeah, and so I'm also gonna all out defense these guys with their own command point, not from him, in case I wanna all out defense somewhere else. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna use one of my command points um, to do all out slaughter, it's my last command point, which will give um, sixes to hit, will cause two hits. Nice. As well. So these are the five with the one leader. That are How going... many attacks are these each? Three? So three attacks each for the witch elves. And plus one for the leader. Um, Plus one for the leader. So that's awesome. five of them attacking the... the oh, gun. shoot. I did forget one thing before you charged. Yep. I was going to yell at them, try to scare them. With... Um, with the, the, the gut represent oh, the, okay, nice. the beginning of the charge phase. What choose a do? unit. Uh, choose a unit within 12. Mm -hmm. I had to beat their leadership, all, uh, mm -hmm. and I get plus one for each five, so I'll get plus two to it. Okay. And you get minus one to hit. Oh, nice. What's your bravery? Eight. Oh, um, then you're fine, because that's 
five, six, seven. I couldn't remember if it's equal to or higher, but seven is definitely lower, so it won't yep, matter. They are bravery seven. Sorry. Okay, so I do not scare seven. them. It's called scare tactics. Yep. But you're not afraid. I'm not afraid of you. So no minus one to hit. We're yelling at you more than you're yelling at us. So threes to hit with um, sixes are two hit. Nice. Now normally I need fours, but it goes up to fives. But then because back to I'm fours. within yeah, twelve <laughs> inches of the so it goes up to fours. Minus and these one will plus be one. minus one and two damage each. Nice. Mm, decent so fours roll. to wound. Oh yes. That's, That's minus fun. one rent, so I'll be up to five up. So every failed five up is a dead orc. Yep. So two damage each. So I did okay, I got four of them. So you killed seven orcs with those five daughters. Woo! So, Four cane! We're gonna pull from the back to make sure we have maximum number Let's of Let's just say this is the back. first time I've run a big block of witches, and I might be doing this more often. Yeah, no kidding. Because this actually hit kind of cool. They hit hard. I'm oh, not yeah. gonna lie. That's, that's, okay. Uh, I, I, do you so, want to roll for these guys? Because we can uh, safely remove them. We, we can I've safely remove this five guy. into that one, yeah, and then so. five more into those. It's up to you. You did 14 wounds, yeah. and they actually won't get a save. They won't. So I just... I, <laughs> I need to get two I wanted to three. see you roll at least once with them so we could see how cool they are. Yeah. Uh, but I think we just demonstrated. So basically, equivalently, you would have killed... Uh, let's see, I made four. So you would have killed... So seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty 20 Hopgrat Slithers with that same attack. Mm -hmm. So I think I can safely remove four. With... Yes. <laughs> That was always, that was a fight first thing, so that was not the choice of who gets to fight. Thanks so now these, you get to choose who fights. Thanks to the Slaughter Queen with her, with her ability here. Some so then Rathi is going to pilot. Hey, stay away from my crossbows. And I am definitely going to Because the only thing in. that's actually hurting Rathi is like, ow, Correct. ow, She's going to slide ow. into the crossbows there. You got, you're within an inch, so you can put everything on them I if you wanted to. I am definitely going to put everything into those crossbows. Yeah, because I can't hurt you her anymore. You cannot hurt her anymore. Oh, <laughs> that, just, that makes you sad. <laughs> you got within three into my shaman, so he can't hand out poison. Am I within three of your shaman? You are, because the Pockrat. Oh, he counts? Does that mean I can attack yeah. your shaman? Well, sure. <laughs> no, no, I'm going to attack the... I need, you kill I need to kill, kill I need to kill the battle. Yeah, you kill them and you're, you're yeah. good to go. I need to kill the battle. So yeah, I'm not going to bother all the defensing because you're Ren 2 in a lot of these yeah. attacks. And they're only six up save. So. so these are eight from the heart render. They're threes and threes minus two, three damage so threes and fours then. Correct. That's minus one to wound. So threes to hit. Okay, yeah, decent. Good solid hit. And, and then, then fours to wound. Instead of threes. And oh, look at those three threes. Three damage. Three flat. Okay, that just kills one and a half. So I'll keep track of that. The so Venom tail. tail is threes to hit. Fours because of... Nope, nothing That's there. One. That would have huh. been D6 damage. Okay, okay. And then 2D6 from the uh, Crown of Serpents. So 10 of those. 10 attacks. Uh, so these are threes to hit as well. These are also, it's like back in the day when you attacked with horses, it's the volume of little attacks that right. can sometimes do more damage than everything else. That's so definitely fours cool. instead of threes. Yeah. So we got four more at four no rend. Four at no rend. Six up saves then. That didn't matter. So I take seven wounds in total. That'll kill three and a half of them. Is there mm -hmm. any way to get you out of combat with me? No. So I might as well just take from the back and keep my leader in, in play. I'm not going to bother fighting you back over here because I can't do any more damage. I don't think there's any movement shenan shenanigans I'm going to try to accomplish because I could, you know, try to pile in and use that to my advantage. But the shaman's stuck in there too. We're all just going to look at you and, 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 and give you here. You can look at me the <laughs> way that you look at your models. Yeah. So I'm just going to see how many daughters of Cain I can, or what are they, witch elves? Witch elves, yeah. See how many of them I can kill. Now I have them with the, they, they're modeled with the double blades, which is what I've done. but. It, I recommend you use the bucklers, which gives them, them a them better save, and on a six to save, they bounce back mortals. Cool. Now, if they die, do they get to fight, or is that just your snake ladies? Just the just the snakes. Got it. <laughs> so I've got 13 attacks with the six remaining. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. About four is to hit that we don't care about. Fives do a mortal wound, sixes do two mortal wounds, because I'm nice. near the sledge raker beast. I like it. No rerolls. Okay, that's pretty darn good. Decent. You got eight mortal wounds, nice. nine, 10, 11, and one hit that we don't care about, four is to wound. Thank you. So 11 mortal wounds. Okay. I'm glad I killed most yeah. of the unit. Yes. Yeah, uh, that would have been bad. Yeah, they murder you back. I have a six up ward. You do save three, Ooh, three of them. So nine so of them will go down. Eight. Uh, eight, eight of them will go eight down. Will die. You know what? I'll One, take two, it. Three, four, five, six. What are you doing? Get back over here. <laughs> Trying to make it so if I go next. No, you fight first Maybe. anyways. So I do fight matter. first. Yeah. Yeah. So many. You know, I can't complain that only six Actually, out of 20 no, of my I'm guys gonna left. Kill, I'm not going to kill them. I'm going to kill these two here. Seven, eight. Sure. Blah. There you go. And that is it, so we can go to Battle Shock now. Yep. Um, so what's going to happen on my end? I don't know what you're going to do. So he's within three inches of them, so I'm not going to bother rolling because they've lost 14 guys, so I'm going to fail it, but only one runs. Yep. 
because they're within three inches of him. The crossbows, on the other hand, I'll spend my last command point on inspiring presence to keep them all there. And I will have to roll for the witches. Uh, they are bravery seven, they lost eight. So you're gonna lose one plus five. So six. Six, run. Uh, that'd be one, two, huh. three, four. So you're a lot like my army. Five, <laughs> six. You hit like a ton of bricks uh, and then you die. I can't really, I was hoping, I was hoping that a lot of them would run and then I didn't I have enough to run, but if I can get out of engagement range, then I can rally them next turn, which yes. would have been really useful. That would have been cool. Yeah. Because you have a command trait that rallies on a four plus. Correct. So that would have been pretty epic. It would have been really nice. But no, sorry, I didn't kill enough of your models. Scary. <laughs> so sad. I tried. Okay, so that's the end of that. You got your battle tactic. Aggressive I do. Expansion. I also was really hoping to potentially burn that objective, but or this one. Not yet. It's, bat it's battle round two, though. Oh, that's, that's right. Anyways. That's right. But at least steal it away from you, so it does. So you're not in control of it. Yeah, from so I can burn it. Be like, ah, screw it. Burn it. Burn it. <laughs> burn it quick. Because <laughs> I will get two points if I go next, and I can burn it. Right. So yep. That'll be kind of nice. Assuming things are one still point. alive. One point. Two. Because I'll have health. Oh, that's right. Turns. You're right. You're correct. Yeah. You are. You. You know the rules. <laughs> it's like I read the scenario <laughs> it's before like we started playing. Like you know what's playing. going on. Okay, so that's the end of your turn one and the end of battle round one. I get so, my two points. You get your two, it score is tied, two, two. That's right. And now we roll to see if you double turn me and destroy the rest of me. That's exciting. <laughs> battle round two, baby. Yeah, let's roll off. Uh, I'm Go, go, go. Yes. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, yoo -hoo! All right, <laughs> double turn. Oh yes, yes please. Okay. What's your battle tactic? So my battle tactic, will be to um, a, a run. Not kill a battle line? <laughs> well, I could, but their battle line, right? Their battle oh, line. Oh, wait, no, their battle line too. Their right? battle line. Yeah. Their I'll, battle line. I'm going to kill the, I will kill a battle line. There you are. Which I'll one do you, you have to pick? I'll, I'll pick the bows. Oh, brave. You yeah. only killed three of them last time. <laughs> I did, but You're I got not to minus one wound anymore. I get to fight twice too, because I'm going to fight in the in the hero face oh. with her command ability, and then I'll do it again. <laughs> that should work. <laughs> Hopefully. Hey hope. Okay. Yeah. Heroic action. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and I have two uh, two command points. So for my heroic action, I'm going to try and get Marathi to give. Actually, before that happens, I am going to um, rally with one of my command points. Okay. And I'm gonna go ahead and rally these snakes. You get one die. That's why I put them in there. Uh, she lets me rally on a four. No, oh. not today. It's too bad. I like that. <clears throat> I wish all totems would do that, by the way. Yep. All totems should rally on a five. Well, it's just, yeah, that would be cool if the battle standard bear actually had something, you know, uh, more of a value than just like being 18, a battle. Yeah, the dwarf one was really cool in the Lost Battle Report, if you watch that, I'm just saying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, other than that, so that doesn't come back. Um, and then I've got my heroic action. I'm gonna go for a command point with Marathi. Try and get me, yeah! Hey, that's your first one, yay! There you go, good job. I got three command points. Getting an extra one would be nice. Uh, <clears throat> heroic willpower could be cool, but I'm just gonna fail them all anyways. And I got three unbinds, so mm -hmm. part of me wants to just do finest hour, and then you'll like kill them, and then hopefully stay alive, and then do three wounds, and I gotta try to kill Marathi. So finest hour. Okay. For for this uh, monster band here, for my snatch a boss. I like it. I am going to give up my unbind from this wizard to try to get rid of your stupid <laughs> snake. <laughs> the snake, he's getting close. Need eight or higher. That's right. Nope. No. All right, the Today. snake stays. Yay, go snake. Snake, <laughs> snake a snake. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and use my bloodshed command ability. It used to be 24 inches, now it's just 18 because she counts as a general. And I will be issuing it to the Shadow Queen. She's going to put all her attacks into them? Just everything into them. So she's still at six attacks. I'll be using the free command point, of course. <laughs> so needing two threes to hit. Oh, no, it's, uh, yeah, so I get, no, plus no one to, I get plus one to charge now, though. So threes to hit. Yeah. Well, so he didn't roll hit. any twos, so it didn't matter. And threes to wound. Yeah, no more minus one wound. No. So uh, that'd be four wounds? 12 damage. Uh, that would be all of them. Why didn't you do that last time? Blar! <laughs> okay. You did it. You killed the battle line. Yes. Yes. That would... We so should I clarify just a rule that we got wrong earlier. Dawns of Death only affects the actual Slaughter Queen. Which oh, so she can't she give would them. Get. She, it's not an aura chant. So they're not currently fight first. They're not fight first. Well, they would lose it anyway. Um, I thought it was a three inch one, but it's not. It's she fights first. So it doesn't either. matter really because you would have fought with them first. Marathi was already She had already for that taken turn. her damage, so she yeah. wasn't going to take any more damage. Anybody not familiar with so Marathi, she can only take three, you can only remove three wounds from her per player turn. <clears throat> so she had lost three wounds from the Unleash Hell. Yep. And so it just made sense. It didn't really matter. But it will matter this turn that they're not um, strike first. Yeah. 
Catechism of Murder. Um, there she she's is. right here. So she picks a. Oh, she's not gonna be able to do it. They're not holy within. Yeah, it's holy within twelve inches, and basically gives a unit. Oh, 14. It's fourteen. Oh, you're inches. good then. You were just you were barely yeah. with. So fourteen with the for them. And uh, yep, they're in. Mm, yeah, okay. From my point of view, they're in. I will give them Catechism of Murder, uh, which will give them just plus one attack, but which just would have been plus one attack, <laughs> which would have been good last turn too. Well, they're still plus one damage, right? Uh, no. Oh, and, and you take a mortal, mortal wound. <gasps> just Kane one or D3. says just one. Uh, I do not um, ignore it. I'm going to go ahead and cast a spell for her, and I'm going to. She has Enfeebling Foe. The Withering, sorry. Okay, so I'm going to do the Withering. I'm gonna, well, I can pick a unit with an 18, but it'll be, I get plus one to wound against that unit. Anybody. Anybody, with any attack. It goes off on a seven. I will um, try to unbind it. Yep. And as has been going in this game, I just can't unbind. Okay, so I am no. probably going to pick this Swamp Caller. Try to guy. kill it before I take the three wounds off of you. Correct. And then kill you on my turn. Correct. Okay. Because that would not be good for me. Uh, so first we're going to do the Black Horror of Ulgu. Ooh, it goes off do? on an 8. I pick a unit within 36, and you might take up to d6 mortal wounds. And I will be picking the monster I need to try and kill. Do you have to be able to see it? Yeah, I can see you. Oh wait, you can see me in that yeah. train. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I... I'm going to try and unbind it. I want to get my you other unbind. unbind. I do. Nice. I had one dispel and then two unbinds. Oh, that's right. Uh, I just wanted to fail the unbind. He's a one as well. He's a wizard, yeah. I so wanted to fail it so I didn't have to worry about it anymore. <laughs> yeah, on a one, you take one mortal wound. Two to three, d3. On a four plus, d6 mortal wounds. So d6. D6, she says. Three. Three it is. Ooh, down to 11 wounds mm -hmm. out of 14. I'm going to try and do Pit of Shades. Uh, needs, I believe, a six. Goes off. I can't unbind. What is their movement? Five. Five. Okay, so minus five to this roll. One mortal wound. <laughs> Excellent. Good job. One mortal wound. Last and not least, we're gonna do Mind Razor. I need an eight for this one. Ooh, well, you can't nice. fail a casting, can you? <laughs> not today. And I, can't, and I can't unbind. Today, I. What does Mind Razor do? Uh, it's a plus one damage if I charge and plus one rent. So plus one rent no matter what? Yes, no matter what. And then so you just won't damage, have the plus one damage. Anyway. Correct. I'm just gonna. I'm still gonna give it to this unit of witches okay. as well. And a hero phase. I did not dispel your end of spell because I can't seem to roll dispel or unbinds. You're going for this wizard. That's right. So roll three dice. You can roll a six. You eat my shaman. I want to try and eat your shaman. Eat the shaman. Go, little viper. No. Yes. Yes, you did it. You I did ate it. him. Um. All right. <laughs> eat my shaman. Yeah, that sucks. Cause he was the one that wasn't. He was the one that could still hand out poison. Oh well. I'm gonna move um, these witches. They're gonna move You're retreating back. them. Yeah, I'm back six. Don't feel like dying. They do not feel. Marathi like fights dying. and then I kill them. They do not feel like dying at all. <clears throat> I don't really need to move my Melusa. She's got her 12-inch like bubble of death, but I am going to bring these. I think I'm gonna move them just a little bit back, just like that, to just make that a little bit of a harder potential charge. Uh, my Melusa, uh, Medusa is gonna. Stare at that unit. So six dice, every five plus is a mortal wound. Correct. And you do one. Can, just one? one? Well, that wound. finishes off the one that you, er, you injured earlier. Excellent. Turns to stone. The bow snakes are going to shoot at that same unit. Just try to finish it off. Uh, yeah, so threes and threes normally. I am going to spend my one command point to Hold do on. fours and threes. I mean to do to all out attack, yeah. sorry. I'm Wait. not going to all out defense this. All out attack. Twos to hit. Six is our mortal wounds. Yeah, so that's four. four so that's two guys dead already. And no minus one to wound this time. Nope, threes to wound. Threes to wound at rend one. So it's six up saves. You've killed them all. They. So they're gone now. Go bow snakes. Marathi is going to stare at you. Uh, so okay. she's going to use twos and gaze. Twos? Yeah, gaze of stone. Oh, nope. apparently not. You missed. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. Any charges? Um, well, I can't charge. They retreated. they retreated. Everybody else is too far away. Uh, yep, so I believe I'm just going to go ahead and fight with Marathi. Well, first we're going to roar at each other. That's right. I'm going to roar at you on a 3+. plus. Roar! Roar! Okay. Do the roar! No, <laughs> no uh, oh, actually, uh, oh, you, I don't need to roar. Oh, no, yeah, I want to roar at you, because I don't want you to all out defense. What's your uh, armor on him? Four up, but I am finest hour, so I'm plus one right now. Oh, you finest houred him. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So you're plus one, so you... Okay, that's fine. Yeah. So it's good that I roared, because if not, you would all-out defense him as well. Yes. 
Wait, you don't have any command points, do I you? do not. Okay, so instead I'll do the Titanic Duel one. Yeah. I don't remember what it's called. I get plus one to hit you. I'm going to move Marathi this way, th uh, three inches. Try to block my Vulture. Correct. I'm not going to save Marathi. <laughs> it's not going to... Marathi's probably going to die, but I'm going to try and make it as hard as possible for you to, uh, you know, do what you need to do. I got it. So I get plus one to charge rolls in my uh, second battle round because of my blood rights. That doesn't matter right now. Marathi gets her... I minus one to hit you, correct? Uh, yes, because I'm stinky. That's right. Thank you for reminding yeah. me of that. I do have stinky. He's a stinky one. Smelly un. Smelly. And because he did not charge, he's minus one to hit. So I need fours to hit you with uh, the big mm, one. A couple threes in there. Yeah. And, and he's then... minus one, sorry, plus one to wound because you hexed him or whatever. Correct. So I wound on twos now. So, so three, three at rend two. Okay, so with my finest hour, I have a five up save. Mm -hmm. So two go through for how much damage? Three each. So that's six damage, bringing him down to five so far. So the Envenom Tail needs a four to hit. Yes, needs a two to wound. It is also Ren two, but this does six damage if it goes Flat through. six? Flat six. So I fail this five up and I'm dead. Oh. I did not. Oh. I'm going to hit you back. <laughs> and then my crown of snakes. So seven attacks. There you go. That hits on twos as well. It uh, well normally it hits on threes, so it's going to wound on f hit on fours, and uh, usually it wounds on threes as well. well. Twos, so twos this time, but no rend on these. Three. Well, three up save. Of course, that's where I fell one there. Okay, well you didn't Ooh. kill it. Well, I, the, you you dodged that venom tail. <laughs> yeah, and I'm going to hit you back. There you go. I'm going to start with his chain linked grappling hook. Yep. So he's got three attacks. Uh, plus one to hit, plus one to wound means it'll be twos and twos. Of nice. course, sixes will be four mortal wounds. Because he's three damage with these, Ooh. and he gives himself the buff of the sixes. Nice. So twos to hit. That'd be pretty good. Okay, let's just start with that, because if you don't roll two sixes, we can stop there. <laughs> Thank you. There you go. All right, you took your three wounds. <laughs> and the rest doesn't matter. That's all sad. And that's that. Your so turn is over. Did you want to burn any objectives? Uh, why, I, how many, you have yeah, you me can, on there? Well, I have a monster, you have a monster. Yeah, so, so you, you own that one, so I, I can't do that yeah. there. Um, and, and I haven't lost control of that one. Yeah, so that's I'm nice. not going to burn any right now. Okay. Because, uh, yeah, because if you double turn me, you'll take away one of my objectives, and then that would not be good. No, if I double turn you, oh, you take away one of my correct. objectives. Correct, okay, so that would be good. So I want to keep as many as I can right now force you to continue to come back to me. However, I killed your battle line with my with my monster, so I will get an additional point. So three victory points. Correct. So five to two. There you go. On to your turn, number two. two. So right away, before I choose anything, I'm just going to try to dispel that stupid endless spell. <laughs> Eight <laughs> makes, plus. Makes sense. Still can't. It's still a little snake's going to come get you. Yeah, yeah, he is. Oh. <laughs> well, he's, this shaman's going to be dead, so I better cast a spell. <laughs> I could give him poison to himself. Yeah. But I'm like, no, no, no i got to cast a spell before I die. I'm going to, oh, I guess i got to do my battle tactic. My battle tactic is... Kill a monster? Uh, it's your warlord, right? Nope. Oh, well, it's, it is my general, but not my picked okay. general. Okay, kill a monster. Yeah. Kill a monster. That monster. <laughs> you monster. <laughs> that means you get two. If you kill it with a monster, you get an extra one. And it's Marathi. So oh, right now, one. while we're filming, they haven't updated the hunter and, like, prey. <laughs> So Marathi so technically is still a hunter. Technically, Marathi is still one of the prime targets. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if they changed that because you, yeah. you know, they balanced it. I don't think they will because it's pretty much the same as it was. A little bit toned down, but that's it's, strange that they would be like. Marathi. We acknowledge this is too powerful, so we're going to give this extra victory point. So why not just balance a, it in the new battle tome? Yeah. 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 Anyway, so yeah, as okay. it stands right now, you kill extra her, you get points. two. Plus, you could get up to four points by killing her this turn. Well, I'm going to try to cast um, the his swamp one, where I get a whole army wide, or the board wide, plus one to charge, and you get minus one to charge. Nice. Uh, hey, I actually make some casting. You might as well try to unbind. I'm going to try and unbind it. You have you have uh, enough unbind. I need so. a nine. Marathi says, "Oh, so close." So the whole table is plus one charge for me, minus one for you. Nice. Do choking miss. That's the one where I put it down. You can't run. You yep. get minus one attack. Um, six is not enough. I need seven. Okay. And that is my spells. Well, I have to roll for this, by the way. Oh, wait, no, I couldn't have rolled that because that was my, he was the one that would have spelled. Uh, I have to roll for this in, in the combat phase. I don't think I get a choice. Um, on a six, it just. It would have gone supernova, gone supernova and then disappeared. It would have gone supernova disappeared. Yeah, it's, sorry, I shouldn't have rolled that second one because I dispelled <clears> with him. And that is. Oh, heroic action. I mm -hmm. guess we should do that too. Oh, and before we go anywhere, I am spending my one command point to, to rally? rally that unit. Okay, let's do that. You rally on fours near your... I have 14 um, witches, yeah. thanks to my 
oratory or whatever. Oh golly, that was, that was above average. Was so only four of them don't come back. So ten. So you back up to sixteen. Come back? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yuck is all I got to say. Hooray! Now I got a free once per game hero phase move with this guy, but the problem is you you've purposely moved Marathi this way, so that blocked off that lane. Because otherwise I'd totally go through and just and have go some, burn it or something. Have some yeah. have some fun back there. Yep. So I'm just gonna have to use it for the front line, unfortunately. So my heroic action will be um, just command point. No, I've already got, I got three. Don't really need them. But there's nothing else to do except finest hour. I'd rather save that for your turn. Mm -hmm. You're gonna eat my shaman in a second. I think, or you could come for them, but whatever. You can eat the shaman, obviously. Uh, the shaman is probably the one I want to eat. Yes. Yes. I would agree. And they're all there ready to cut up the vulture if it comes for them. Because I'm gonna have to fight Marathi first, because I have no shooting. Oh, this is a hard choice. Ah, you know what? Pedal to the metal. Finest hour. Okay. <laughs> now this Love jumps it. over. Yeah. Well, Roll I get three. my I get my heroic action. Oh, whatever. You don't need it. <laughs> I'm gonna do <laughs> do a command uh, point there. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Yeah, yeah good for you. Speech. Good for you. Sarah. Yeah, good for me. <laughs> All right. Roll three dice. Get that six and eat my shaman. Come on. You can oh, do it. Oh, my viper is hungry. No, uh, no. Oh. not hungry well, I'm today. disappointed. I would have saved him to run up and help kill Marathi. <laughs> well, movement. You want to redeploy? Nope. Okay. Next movement. Uh, them, I guess. Here we go. Cool. Now I shall now redeploy. No, oh, yeah. And watch, oh. you roll a six. Ha, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Called yeah. it. Yeah. What's yeah. the reach on him? Uh, I don't know. An inch? Up to three? Does he have three? <laughs> <laughs> the guy on top. Uh, I don't know. It's all one inch. It's all one. Mount okay. guy on top. So I just, I definitely just want to make sure you can't fight my blood rack to do so, which is like the biggest thing. Oh, and so I you would, just want to keep her rack. And I want to make sure that you can't engage my snake. I am, I am plus one that. charge, so yeah, I should be able to still get there. But then you'll get to fight first because I'll be yeah, punching, I'm just, punching Marathi first. I'm just making sure you can't like allocate attacks to her and you can't get within three of Yeah, my, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. Just, I'm I get just, it. Trying to play tactical. I am. Do you, you, don't, you don't want to ease up. Do you up. even know me, bro? <laughs> We're going to run these hobgrats. They're going to go four. Joke's on you. They're going to come up and throw some bombs at you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And they're going to kill so many that your screen's going to be gone. And I'm going to charge. I'm going to hit your whole back line. You know what? That's exactly how things happen. <laughs> <clears throat> They'll run six. Oh, Ooh, yeah. Very nice. And they're just going to come into here. No, very, no, no, very no, no, no. perfectly measured. I like it. Shaman will step gingerly around the angry blood snake. Uh, is your shaman a uh, Hunters of the Heartland? I don't care if you stomp me. I'm going to stomp you. <laughs> Not yet. I still get to charge and oh, get away no. from it. Yep. No shooting. Yep. So it's time to charge. Okay. I'll declare charge with them first. Okay. And they go up 12 <gasps> inches. <gasps> well, you're not getting away from me. I oh, wait. No. Oh, oh, you know oh. what? I'm just not going to shoot. No, shoot. No, I already rolled the. I want to keep that charge. <laughs> I'm keeping that charge. You I'm can, not going back. No, I it's a charge. I would let you keep the charge no, and I, shoot. That doesn't feel right. Nice. Well, here they come. Yeah, at, at most, I'd like. They're like fours and threes. I'd kill like one or two. What's of your the. Witches. Oh, you don't. I don't care about. Does he do mortals as well? When you do combat? You betcha. Stuff. He does? Okay. You bet your bottom. Yeah, but your bottom dollar. You gonna unleash? I got one, two, three, four, five, six bows that can shoot you. Bring and it. each one of these has a million attacks. No. Well, the, I have five of them kill like 10 of my unit last time. But no, they don't two have- two attacks each. Yeah, but they don't have the- They won't be near this guy to get the extra mortals. They don't have the extra mortals. Okay, yeah, yeah. I am going to spend a CP to unleash hell. Bring it. Hitting Minus on. one to hit, so four right. to hit. I'm looking for sixes, just like you are, Matthew. I know, I get it. Okay. Well, well you got one of them. One six. It's not pretty bad. bad roll there, scary. <laughs> I, <laughs> I brought I brought ten back with a rally. I know, I'm right? I'm not going <laughs> to complain. So, so two wounds at minus one. Correct. So six up. And a mortal. So two wounds get there, kills one. Good, good well, job. That's not two attacks in one. They'll never have gotten there, because this guy's going to charge uh, five inches. I think that's not enough. Mm -hmm. no. no. Is that enough? You need a six. Okay, and then I will you issue roll, you a reroll. You need to roll a five. I'm going to declare, uh, he's going to give him the reroll though. Okay. Because then he could issue, no, nah, I doesn't need a reroll. It doesn't matter who does this. Okay. Ah, I made it. Whoa. That's... Oh, I rolled a five, right? You rolled a four, a three and a one. Oh, and four became a five. Yeah, you need to roll a five. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. I got plus one in charge. <clears throat> so he's just going to come in there as well. Kapow! Rawr. Shaman will charge. Oh, Twelve inches, far away from the snake. <laughs> All over here. 
You know, he's going to put the pot right What did the snake ever do to you? He just ate your friend. Okay, that's all the snake ever did. We're good there. So monster stuff. Yep. Are they hunters? They are. Oh, of course they are. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, so I am going to Titanic Duel. Okay. Or what, I don't know what it's called. Is it Titanic Duel? I almost want to say this. Um, sure. Whatever, do the roar. I think it's Titanic Duel. I will roar just to try and... Uh, but you do three mortal wounds still with that? Like, or four mortals with a six? Yeah, so you could always stomp the shaman. I'm going to stomp the shaman. It's not like I'm going to do anything. You can't kill him. It's only it takes three, three mortal wounds. That does... Rawr. <laughs> Joke's on you, the snake's just gonna eat him anyways. But if and now he doesn't, he's, if Yeah, he but doesn't. when the snake eats, he'll be like, where's, where's the beef? Because <laughs> he just got, it's just like half of his god. <laughs> so we are going to pile in like this. I'm assuming this. you want to kill Marathi first. Yes, which yeah. makes I'm sense. gonna stay within six inches of the objective. Yep. <clears throat> but I'm piling in this way to keep my 12 inch ore over there for the extra mortal wounds. Yep. You ready to see Marathi die? Oh, baby. If she lives though, if she lives, this would be glorious. Yeah, it doesn't seem likely. But I don't know, man. We never know what's going to happen. It's a dice game, as you say, Matthew. Twos to hit, but sixes are wonderful. Oh, oh so close. Plus so two close. hits, threes to wound. Okay, okay. Two wounds. Okay, what's the rend? Minus one damage. Oh, you mean minus one damage? Minus, minus one, one rend. Okay. Right. So I believe I need a five up. So three damage each. Oh. So one gets through for three damage. So oh, just, that's right. I get a don't roll a six, and so we don't have to. Keep I get a ward. No, just don't. So I don't think you roll. Nah, Thank you. We're you done got there. Her. Oh, goodbye, Brathy. No. Oh, and the little Brathy disappears too as a bonus. Yep. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> All right. All right. I, I'm not gonna win, but boy, does that feel good. Yeah, I'm sure it does. I'm sure it does. All right, little witch elves, do All your right. stupid thing. Let's go fight you now. Oh yeah, does that thing? Gonna see if it supercharges. <laughs> not this turn. Not this turn. Oh, Thank you. Sad. I don't want it this turn. I really wanted a supercharge. Right All right, now. piling in. Um, I'm going to be. They'll declare an all-out defense on themselves, and the killer boss will declare an all-out defense on himself because he yep. can do the same one. You gotta try and keep them alive as much as possible. You betcha. And that'll be all my command points, by the way, because I'm not worried about them running. What do so we I was have? Able 11. To squeeze 11 into your orcs. And then and five. Then, uh, oh, it should be 16, 16 of them total. Yes, yeah, so, so five into those. So 11 to the gut rippers, five into the kill a boss on rip a vulture. Yep. Something. Yep. Into the vulture. Hitting on threes. That's Very a good nice. hit. That's a good hit. And then I normally wound on fours, but I'm wounding on threes because of my totem. The totem gives you plus one to wound. That's right. That's just a witch elf unit if they're next to a totem. So mm. that would be seven at rend one. And only one damage right now. One damage because of, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they get the extra damage on the charge with that spell. Correct. So I am all up defensed and finest hour. Nice. So that brings me to a two up. I know I can't get better than a three up, but you're minus one rend, so three up. Yep. Hey, I did a wound. one wound. So down to 13, and now a lot of attacks into my, my gut repos. Okay, so this is, <laughs> this is a lot of attacks. I wish I had exploding sixes come on point right now, but I needed to redeploy to try and make oh, that the charge a little harder. I think the redeploy was good. Was a Except roll. I made my charge, so. You did. Oh, you rolled it. You rolled really well yes. on that. That was pretty good. And then on threes, thanks to the totem. 16 go through in total. That's I get right. a five up save against these. Ooh. Well, so, no, that was bad. 12. So one, two, three, four, five, six of them die. Ah, yuck. That wipes out too many of them. I don't care about losing the banner at this point. Banner gives you extra Plus one uh, bravery? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Nice. I'm going to do the Gut Rippers first. I just don't want this Medusa to kill any more of them. I don't think you're going to really do any damage to the the, the Vulture. Mm -hmm. The Ripa Vulture. Yeah. So seven attacks from them. Uh, hitting on four. Sixes do one mortal wound. I'm not close enough to mm -hmm. the two. So one mortal wound and three hits. Wounding on fours. One wound, no rend. No so you rent. get a save and a mortal wound. Okay, so a six up save. So two of them die. Oh, six up wards. And then the six up ward. Two of them die. Two go down. I will be pulling, uh, I guess, this one here. And so I can pile in, and then I guess this one over here. And then the Medusa can pile in and fight the, That's right. them as well. Mm -hmm. So the spear, three attacks from the blood rack spear, threes to hit. And, oh, and nothing. No wounds. Nothing. Four attacks from the whisper claw. Threes to hit, Ooh. and threes to wound. Two at no rend, just one damage. Four up. Well, that's another wound. Okay, just one damage there. Anything else? D6 from the Tail of Serpents. Ooh, six attacks. Oh, this thing has a lot of attacks. Yeah, fours to hit and fours to wound. 
Nothing. Oh, okay, so I take one wound in total yeah. from all that. I take one wound from all of that. I yep. should be the guy that runs anyways. All right, my kill a boss on uh, Rip a Vulture is going to attack. Being close to this makes me minus one damage, which Correct. makes this thing. This is going to be very, very not interesting. Uh, almost every roll up, nothing but sixes. So my jagged boss sticker is going to hit you on threes. Nice. Oh, okay. That's uh, six mortal wounds. Oof, very nice. <laughs> okay. Okay. One hit that will wound you. Yeah, it wounds you. Rent. It's minus one. And the normally two damage, so one damage, so okay. you don't so get it. So that'd be an extra one there. Is okay, that so seven so far. Seven so far. The beak and flesh tearing talons are also poison. So it'll be fours to hit, but sixes do three mortal wounds. Oh, very nice. Mm. See, I don't really care about the hits because you're minus one damage. It's two wounds at minus one, so that's one more damage each. Okay, and that's it. Nine. No, no, we're not No done. more stuff. Do you... There's a little stinger. <laughs> Let's just roll a six and call it a day. No, it's actually threes to hit. Okay. A six would have done d6 plus one, so d6 mortal wounds. Nice. Oh no, so d6 mortal plus one mortal wounds. I yeah. owe you uh, this many word saves. That's right. Just to kill the guys that I already killed. That's right. Look, I killed all the guys I already killed. Nine killed of them died. Nine of them. Yeah. Well, well, that brings you down to three, which you had four at the beginning of my turn. <laughs> yeah, well, let's see, because I don't have any... Uh, at least you can't rally on I your turn. I don't have a command point. Because I used it for. A, oh, that's true. So I guess attack. the rest of them would just run. So you might as well just remove them all. Yeah. Because there's no way that you're not running from that. Uh, leadership eight. Yeah. So. And you've lost eleven. So it's minimum three more running. Four more actually, and you yeah. only have three left. So they're gonna. They're also gonna run, but only one will run. Yep. Because a buddy boy near them. That's what the killer boss does. Technically, the shaman could have gone. So what? What I'm gonna do is just have him pile in this way. So he's yep. within three inches of that, just in case I want to hand out some poison. Yep. And I am going to, you, right now you got your birds in the sky, so I'm going to do a bit of a jerk move here. I'm going to burn all three objectives! Oh, six victory points for me! <laughs> oh, even though it pretty much <laughs> ensures that I can't win the game. Eh, unless I get through. If I well, double turn I have now. no more Marathi, right? So if you double turn... You see, this way, double turn, you go ahead and choose an objective correct. to get rid of. Exactly. Yeah. That comes down so to So a double turn could actually maybe do something interesting here. As we will That's see. That's fun. You're just all in, and it's fantastic. I am. I am. I'm all in. It's fantastic. So it's six victory points, plus four for killing Marathi. So it's ten. Battle tactic, killed it with a monster, and she's a, yeah. a supreme, awesome priority target. So you're target. at ten right now. So, and, and you have how many? Five? I had five. So, so you had twelve. Twelve to five. Because you had two six, before. Twelve. Yeah. Twelve to five at the okay. end of battle round two. I like it. But you, you burnt your objectives. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this okay, this is a big roll. Dang it! I will, I will retain the initiative. Thank you very much. They don't want me to go, Tommy? No. Oh, well, double turn. They're or, all worth four for me now. No, so. I get to get rid of one, though. Oh, you do? I get to choose which one goes. Pick one. I don't know. It all doesn't matter. <laughs> I can't get anywhere. Pick one. Uh, pick it. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> all you have to do is burn all three of them. And... I dare you. I dare you to pick it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm just going to defree it. Left to right. All right, the middle, middle one. Yeah, get rid of it. Okay. Grand strat or battle tactic? What's it gonna be? Uh, I'm gonna kill a monster. Okay. Want to be more specific? I'm gonna kill that monster. Oh yeah? Yep. Just like that, eh? Who's yep. gonna be pointing? That's what I wanna. That's what I wanna kill. All right. Yep. Well, jokes on you. I'm gonna heroic recovery him. Oh yeah. Jokes on me. Hey, it worked. Nice. <laughs> it's like his crap bravery. So <laughs> he gets two of his wounds He's back. He's back up to six. Yeah. You're gonna nice. have to work a little harder. Nice. I like it. <laughs> Uh, now I battle round three, so I get plus one to hitting close combat. And what's your uh, what's your heroic action? My be? heroic action will be a uh, well. Now that my my oh no, my general's still alive. Yeah, you're So I get my I get my two standard. I'm gonna go for a um, uh, heroic recovery here. I think. No, I'm gonna go for an extra command. I was gonna say you don't believe. Really yeah, four up. Nope. Nope. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna try to dispel the snake before you eat my my, okay. my priest. Eight okay. plus. Yeah. Uh, plus. <laughs> Although you just gonna, no, you can't bring it back. This I can't turn. bring it this turn. Yeah. Yeah. Next turn, I'll have to come back. I'm gonna pray. So she's gonna give herself a uh, uh, fight first, because that's her one prayer. Nope. <laughs> she's gonna take a mortal. Does she care? Yes, yeah, she does. Uh oh. Down to three. And then she's gonna give them uh, exploding sixes in close combat. Cocked. And she takes another mortal wound. Well, it was the first one wasn't cocked. Yeah, it was clearly a five. It's cocked enough for me. Right, I guess fine. by 
by uh, Matthew Sanders. Well, no, it's like if you could tell yeah, what it is, I, I can. Okay, fair enough. In I will take it. In tournaments, I, I can see it. you having like a hard and fast rule that the, if it's even slightly off. If it's not flat on the mat. No, it, I, I get it. Right. I get it. For yeah. me, it's like if you can tell what it is, okay. then you keep it. Makes sense. Yeah. I will take that. Yeah, and if you're like if there's an argument, then what you do is you look straight down. And if it's oh, mostly, that's that's what we do. I guess the camera. But would. the whole idea is to not have arguments. It's like, yeah, just take it. Like, yep. like there's sometimes where it's obviously cocked, and every other time it's like, just keep it. So okay. That's how I like to play. Yep. I'm gonna go ahead and do withering again because I can't bring my snake back, and it goes off on a six, I believe. Yeah. Well, if, but yeah, I didn't unbind, of course. I dispelled once. I can't really complain. The six is actually the withering is anyways. a seven. Yeah, it does not go off. I think that's your only spell, but right? But plus one to. Uh, Plus one to cost would have been, I mean, plus one to wound would have been really useful against yeah, that monster. Because it works for shooting too, right? Correct. So which is really, it's 18 inches. That's a really powerful spell. Because yeah. it's any attack, which is nice. Yeah, exactly. All right, well, let's do some uh, Some movement. Movement stuff, yeah. Are right, they going to move? Yeah, I'm locked in combat with that Medusa. Yep. Where are you going? Huh? I'm just going to. Why are you uh, leaving? Just going to make sure I am oh, within 24 of him because I want to shoot him. Excellent. You couldn't make them shoot? Oh, that, was that a Marathi that's only command Marathi. ability? Yeah, oh, yeah, that's yeah. a bigger deal of yeah. killing Marathi than I remembered. Yeah. Mar Marathi, Marathi's like a... Uh, they're going to move up. They're going to stay outside of nine of him. So he can't read a point. Correct. But they are going to move up like okay. so. And remember, you are minus one charge. Yep. Plus one, minus one. It'll, it'll balance out. You know what? I will redeploy the Shaman, though. Yep. Watch this. Ready? Oh, my. What the freaking crap? That was, a, that was a good roll for Yeah. Him. He's going to go like this. Block me? As much as he can. Yep. He got a plus one to your charge, so <clears throat> you can kind of go around, around him. him. Yeah. There okay. We there we are. And then we. And then there's a <laughs> shriek in the sky as the heart renders descend. Ga -ga! Heart renders have shown up. Mm, boy. They're just gonna get their javelins ready. Because yeah, they can shoot and then move. That's right. Shooting phase. What's you firing? Uh, bow snakes. So we're all gonna shoot at that at, uh, that swamp crawler guy th thing. He is a sludge raker beast. With a snatch of boss on top. I don't know how you don't get those words <laughs> straight. I'm trying, okay? All right, I'm work out. Remember work something out. about a swamp, yeah. something about sludge. <laughs> exactly. There something you go. about being stinky. Yeah. Okay, the arrows are let loose. Okay, threes and threes. Sixes, sixes do more ones. Yeah, just do, three, just do six sixes and save us some time. No. Nope. Or zero sixes. Or none. And make this all keep oh, going on. No. <laughs> and threes. Uh, yeah, you didn't get the plus one wound off. Yeah, well, at least, uh... Didn't matter. That's, uh, nine at minus one. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I mentioned off-camera discard that it's gonna all-out defense when he shot me, so... They're all-out defense. So minus one, you said? Yes. So four out. There you go. Uh, so four of them go through. I've got two wounds left. Is that Excellent. all you got? Well... Is that all you got? I know it's try not. these, uh, heart renders. So javelins? Let's do the javelins. Funk. So the first unit, which will be the one that's in your territory. Bring it, man. Uh, Bring threes it. Threes and threes to try and do some damage here at rend one. Okay. Two, rend one. Four up save. Okay. He's got one wound left. Oh Did you want to move after that? Goodness. Yeah, I do want to move with them after that. Uh, no, no, I'm not moving forward. I'm not moving forward. Well, I thought you were going to charge or no. something. No. <laughs> Where are you going? No. Oh, strike and fade. Oh, yeah. Where are you going? Look back here, as far away from you as possible. What else are they going to do? They're going to hide. Why? Okay? There's no objectives to grab. I know. Oh, fine. I'm All right, the other, the other ones are going to try to finish him off? Uh, yes. Yeah. Here okay. we go. Okay. Three to hit. Okay. You know he's dead, right? I certainly hope so. Three wounds. Three wounds. I've got to make three four up saves. There you the go. The math on that says 12.5% chance. We'll see. We'll see. See? I got him. Ooh. You got him. Ooh. Okay. Look good. at you. I couldn't afford not to have my battle tactic go off. That would have been bad. Oh, I have an extra victory point because I killed a monster. Yeah. So it was five victory points. Yes. So it's two plus the one for him being a plus monster. Plus one. Plus, plus one, one for, for killing and a monster. And I killed him with a monster. So it's a thirteen. Yeah. Yes. Look at that. See. Yeah. Ooh, cool it's gonna be. Out. It's gonna come down to the battle tactics. Yeah. That's what it's yeah. gonna come down to. And then they scooched back. So we yeah. got some charges now. Are you gonna charge in there? Uh. Yep. So we're just gonna. Well, sh my Medusa gets to uh, sh uh, shoot. Oh, I guess she's gonna that. pick the unit. This little two strong unit on fives does a mortal. Sure. Not the the leader. Now you can charge. Okay. Anything but double one. You did it. I did it! Yay! What do you put the measuring tape away? Uh huh? Just no, I'm measuring. Shove them in. I'm measuring. I'm not, I'm not measuring that. I'm measuring <laughs> something else. It's just a shaman. <laughs> yeah, I'm measuring. Watch out for his boppity stick, though. They can actually do a lot of mortal wounds. Cool. Good old. I'm gonna fight with her first and just disengage this giant vulture. Oh, well, look at you. Whoop. 
<laughs> fancy pants magoo. <laughs> Joke's on you, that means I get to go wherever the crap I want. Nah, uh, it's fine by me. I just don't want you to eat them anyways, right? Now. right? <laughs> <laughs> three attacks, but I get, uh, it's turn three, so I get plus one to hit now. Oh, I'm just that. trying to think about it. It was my last command point for all of defense. Now that I know you're not going after the roof. No, I like to keep the shop. I don't, it doesn't matter. All of defense. Okay. Threes to hit. Oh, twos to hit now, because I'm plus one to hit. Because of my blood rights. Threes to wound. Rend. Two at rend one. So five up. D3 damage each. And we're done. Yay! That was fun. <laughs> <laughs> the shaman comes out. He's going to stay back here to represent his three inch reach with his bog bark Ooh. staff. I know, I don't know why it's Very three fancy. inches, but it's three inches. Nice. And we're not going to worry about what he rolls to hit because he's just going to roll double six. I like it. Okay, so those actually both do hit unless you're minus one to hit. Nope. Threes to wound. So two wounds at minus one. Okay, so six ups. Oh. Oh. No. Nope. D3 damage each. Nice. Wow, six nice. damage. Does that kill that. three of them? Uh, six up. Yeah. You killed two of them. Oh, I'm not done yet. End. I'm not oh. done yet. I got a little pot shoot. crap. No, don't. Don't shoot he's, that little grunt. He's got, he's got a little shiv. Don't shoot. <laughs> but he's dipped it in the pot. Does he also get the more? Yeah, yeah, oh because he's not goodness. a separate thing. He's just yeah, yeah. on the That's profile. That's fantastic. He's not a mount or anything. That is awesome. Uh, so fours to hit, but sixes will be a mortal wound. Okay, okay. Oh, no mortal wound. I just wanted to shank it. <laughs> fours to wound. Okay. No, no, no rend. rend. No rend. Six and up. Six up. Come on, don't get killed. Oh, I shanked it. Ow. He shanked it. Got killed by Grot. Yeah, you think you'd under, underestimate a shaman. Sad. Okay, my turn. Yeah. Can you, can you do three wounds? And then we're going to go ahead and four attacks for her. Hitting on twos now. And winning on threes. At rend one. Four at rend one. There's <laughs> <laughs> one damage, though. I think I'm. Five up. Yeah, five up save. Yeah, well, one damage. I got to make two sixes. You got him. Hooray. See you later, shaman. I did forget to stomp here, Medusa. <gasps> okay. Yeah, you take one mortal wound. Do I care? I do care. Yeah, just one. Five. The morale? I owe you bravery. What's your I bravery? I don't think I have any. Oh, no, I haven't used any command traits. I'm going to auto pass them. You, sure. <laughs> yep, I didn't use any of my command points this turn. The, uh, the all out attack would have been really useful in the snakes. <laughs> Oh, you got him. <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't. You got him. But I, you know, anyways, whatever. It's all good. So, okay. anything you're going to do with those objectives in the back? I'm going to burn them. I'm just going to burn them. I'm so, gonna that's worth two each? Eight. No, four, four each, because so you I have them for eight. three turns. I get eight, and my battle tactic, which is two. So, it's ten. So, it's ten plus killing a monster this turn. It's so eleven. Eleven to my five. So, sixteen. Sixteen to your thirteen as we move on let me to. Double, let me recalculate mine. Yeah, so it is sixteen seven, to thirteen. Uh, so it's sixteen to thirteen for you. Is it sixteen? You, um, yeah, you just said 16. I got 8 plus 2, so that's 10, plus killing monster, 11, plus my, f yeah. my, plus my 5. Yes. yes. So 16 and 13. Yeah, that's as right. As we go into my battle round 3, or my turn 3. Yeah. Battle tactic will be kill a battle line. Okay, and it is the start of a Although, new... I don't have the firepower to do it. It's a new uh, new battle round, so I'm going to spend one of my command points to rally this unit of snakes. Stop it! <laughs> Are you close enough to do that on a force? I definitely am. Two just just come back. go away. <laughs> or maybe I'll do kill them for the battle line. <laughs> ah, bloop, bloop. I don't know, man. Slithery, slithery. It's goodness. all. It's, it's. I don't think I can win to be honest. Um, I've already not got my grand strategy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what was your grand strategy? Uh, mine is a doors a cane one. Every unit in my army has to fight, fight close or combat. die. But they haven't fought in close combat. Not yet. They will, hopefully, to by the end of the game. Oh, no, no. We're going to get far away from them. <laughs> Everybody run away. <laughs> he loses if we run. Uh, let's go for kill, kill a warlord. You're going to kill the general? Yeah. Do you get an extra point for doing that with a monster? Uh, I'm not sure. We'll yeah, I know check. some of them you do, some of them you don't. Yeah. But either way, going to kill a monster. Um, I will finest hour her. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go for. Oh, I have to roll for this. Does it explode? Oh, it does. It did. Oh, Good luck. Sad. Goodbye. Not sad. Um, then my, of course, I'm gonna heroic recovery and hey, I made it. I'm back to full. And then no, I have a spell. Yeah. <clears throat> Arcane bolt or mystic shield. I don't think the one where you can't run is a big deal, except for maybe plopping it back over here on them and say no, you don't get to fight. Yeah, choking miss. I failed. Okay, doesn't okay. matter. I'm. Um, Gonna move away from these guys so they don't get a chance to fight. Okay. And then we're gonna we're gonna redeploy her. Oh, okay. <laughs> Where are you going? I don't know. Six inches. Five. Five. Decently like, enough. Shit. Fine. It's not even gonna be that much further away. <laughs> Just trying to draw me back, aren't you? Yep. I get it. <laughs> well, <laughs> jokes on you. I'm gonna kill her shooting. <laughs> They're just gonna move there. That's right. And we're gonna run the other Hobgrats. Yep. Two. 
Mm -hmm. And they're gonna run up here. So the, the hob rats in the back ran, the ones in the front didn't, that matters. We're gonna throw a bunch of grenades at you. So we got six from the back squad, ten from the front. It's gonna be them all at the same time, because there's no other targets. Cool. There are fours and threes minus one. Did you want all about defense? Uh, I have one command point remaining. I will not. Fours to hit. Good thing sixes don't do anything. Mm -hmm. Threes to wound. That's very nice. That actually was a good roll. That's six of them. So heroic hour. Oh, five five stars. So you take three. Six is to nope. ignore. So you're Takes down to three. Down to two remaining. Ah. Okay. Two remaining. At least you didn't okay. die. To so like... did you double check if a monster killing it does extra? I right, we can check that. Answer is yes. So I do have to go this way. I was hoping to charge there kill them with just a bunch of little shivs, because they're actually pretty decent. Mm -hmm, and then mm -hmm. charge them and try to kill a bunch of them so you can't really retaliate. Um, but you need every point you can get, Matthew. I do. So we're going to start with him charging. Yep. No, because I can reroll twice. No, I only got one command point left. So, ah, well, that's good. Nice. We're going to come as far over here as we can to stay away from anybody who thinks they want to still fight. Yep. And then those hobgrats will charge in just for, yeah, that's good enough. Just barely. I like it. They're just, uh... Re, uh, they're just insurance. They're not battle line or anything. There's no reason to care about keeping them alive. I will try to stomp them because that <gasps> still counts. Uh -oh. two, two plus D three. Only one mortal wound, so Six I won't kill them. I can't uh, see nope, it. That nope. Is down to one wound. Down to one. All right. Well, we're gonna kill you with that warlord. You ready? I'm definitely save us some ready. time. I'm just gonna get some sixes. Dang it. <laughs> Threes to I'm hit. I'm gonna all that. Oh no, you you stomped on me. I got all that defense with my last command point. Sure. That's minus one. So whatever your save is. Okay. Plus one. Well, uh, you're finest hour, aren't you? Finest hour. So you're right. so, so you're plus four two. Up. Yeah. Well, whatever. <laughs> I got my beaks. I got my beaks. Ha! Ah! That's uh, four mortal wounds. Oh no! Can you roll four sixes? Yes, huh? I can. Huh? Huh? Oh, huh? Huh? Get out of here, Medusa. <laughs> she brought back. Take your serpentine so ways many. elsewhere. She brought back so many. Hobgrats will then pile in this way. Yup. Provide some sort of screen. I like it. That's three victory points, y'all. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> End of the battle round three. 16 to 16. I can't right. get my grand strategy. In order for you to get yours, everybody has to fight in close combat so or they die. Have to fight, they have to fight. And these two and have to fight. they two have to fight. Yeah, that one already or fought. Die. It is all, it's I'm not going to kill him. I'm not going to kill him. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make you kill him. No, you or, can't. <laughs> yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, I'll stay away from him. <laughs> I'm a pacifist today. Not today. I'm going to double turn you now, and I'm going to fly as far away from all of them as possible. <laughs> I see how this is, Matthew. I'm just going to get into your side. Cain wants blood. Yes. Cain definitely wants blood. So I'm not double turning you? No. <laughs> is that what you're saying? <laughs> okay. <laughs> So I'm going to use a Doors of Cain battle tactic, which will be use my Fire and Fade on two units of renders. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. Three points! Who Yay! Cares? It didn't matter to me anyways. <laughs> I'm going to try and get an additional command point. It's on a two plus now. Yeah! Because my Warlord is dead. Yeah, me too. I don't have anything else to do. Because I'm already a wizard, and you're not a wizard. And... Yeah, it doesn't matter. I didn't get anything. I still want. I already have. Okay, and then what I'm going to spend one of my command points to try to bring back rally. That's are right. you it's are on sixes now, though. I was going to say because you, you did kill my thing. general. Come on, snake snakes! Yeah! Oh, come on! Go snakes! Come on! <laughs> get lost! <laughs> <laughs> you want to pray? I'm going to pray. I get two prayers. One, I'm going to give uh, exploding sixes to that unit. Yeah. She did it. And then she's going to give herself plus one. Uh, always fight first. That doesn't matter. That's Hooray! Amazing. Does she care? Oh, she doesn't care. <laughs> Move. I need to get her in combat. So she's going to... Okay. Redeploy. Oh. The uh, little sergeant here is going to issue it to the big guy. Okay. The reason he's doing that. The sergeant is. has to issue it to their own unit. Sergeants don't... Oh, yeah. They can't issue it to us. <laughs> but he's going to do it anyways. <laughs> hey! Get going! Okay. <laughs> he moves six inches. Obviously, he's issued Ooh, it to himself. Guy? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm just getting away from all your... I'm getting away from them. <laughs> the problem is they can probably fly up and still shoot them. Yep. Oh, that sucks. If you had moved within nine inches of them, they would have redeployed, mm -hmm. and then he would redeploy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you knew that. Well, I'm sure that's exactly what I you, thought. You that was like my plan all you along. Weren't, you weren't <laughs> You didn't even pay attention. It still worked. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stay out of nine of them. However, I will be moving these little snaky snakes. Okay. Right. To just get nice and close and right. stay out of nine. Okay. Yeah, there you go. I'm not going to tell you it doesn't matter now. Nom, 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 that's nom, okay. Nom, nom, nom. They, nom, they nom. can't do it anyways. Nom, nom, nom. Uh, Where are you going? Both. You know, Where you know, are you going? You know what? The yeah, like that's they, right. They need to fight as well. I was like, you so have I'm to gonna, fight. Why are you I'm, leaving? I'm, <laughs> you're going to lose. I'm going to fight. <laughs> 
Oh, can they get within 12 inches so they can shoot? Uh, are you within 26? Mm, yep. Oh, freaking crap. <laughs> well, if jokes on you, the ones that are going to die first will be the ones closest. Potentially, potentially. So you're going to do so well, you're going to kill them all, and you're just going to be... You know what? You're going to be I kicking will, yourself. I will, I will do my best. You do have a plus one charge now, right? Ah, uh, yes, yes, okay. I do. And then the other squad will zip one. up as well. Boop. Boopity boop. Oh, I was hoping to get out of their shooting range because then they wouldn't be able to fire and then move. Yeah, I really like the Doors of Cain, the new battle tactics. It means I can I can reliably score a lot of points, <clears throat> which well, is awesome. Nice. Okay. So archers no, first into no, the hobgrass. No, no, what are you do? What are you talking about? <laughs> no, but they're going to be so good at killing no, them. No, I'm going to shoot. This. <laughs> no, no, they have no reason. They're going to shoot it. first. What are they doing? <laughs> I got four of them. Yeah, the bring it. I'm going to no out Trying defense. Trying to get me to shoot the I'm gonna, I'm going to no out defense. So you get plus three to hit and plus three to wound. And okay. extra rends and four uh, extra damage. So two hits. Oh, come on. And one wounds at rend one. Oh, that kills one. Cool. And then they're just going to move up as you move uh. that casualty. <laughs> I was hoping you killed so many that you couldn't shoot the second squad. Nom, 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 nom. All right, then the second squad shoots. Okay, then the five little shots as well. So if you... Oh yeah, that still counts. I'm like, if you charge in with one squad and kill the squad, the other squad is there, but it still counts as having fought because you still pick it and it piles Correct, in. Correct, because it's still pick to fight. One, at rend one. Yeah, so it's still pick to fight. Yeah. It's a weird thing, but... It is. Oh. All right, well, it doesn't really matter. Then. And now the archers. What they, they will. At? I will be using my all-out um, all attack. All attack on them. All right, all defense. Three, four... Hitting on twos. Now the reason I don't need it for the combat phase is now it's turn four, so I get plus one to hit and plus one to wound in combat anyway. So all sure. out attack doesn't matter for me anymore. Uh, so twos to hit, needing some sixes. Okay, sixes, sixes. explode. Okay, oh, oh, and then threes to wound you. These are all at rend one. 13 wounds, yep. I got a four up save, plus one minus one. So I take three six plus the two mortals, so I take eight wounds. He's down to six. I like it. Charge phase. Charge now. Yeah. Uh, well, let's start with these heart renders in the back. Don't fail it, otherwise you might not get your grant. Oh, you made it. <laughs> I, think yeah, we're about, I think we're just about done this battle report. <laughs> I think in a moment there's not going to be anything left for me on the table. Let's, uh, let's just... Wow, that was a good roll, too. <laughs> That's what I was... And you got plus those. one of that, so it's a 13-inch charge. That's right. You, you these, can... these heart renders are going to try to get in as well. They made it. They go Yay. 10. I'm going to go... Oh, they fly. Yeah. That's right. Boop. All right, ah, go ahead. Just go put them behind you. Fine. That's right. I know what I, I I'm, I'm sure. trying very hard to be really sneaky. Look right at you. Here. Look at that. Look at you. For that. Oh, oh boy. man. Oh boy. Oh, Super boy. sexy. This, this is this is what door does a cane yeah. is all about. Uh, sure. I'll yeah. Charge not double ones. Well, if you don't, you can't get your grand strategy. I need to make sure I get it now. <laughs> That's why. Charge. charge. This, these uh, snakes are coming. Anything but a double one. Well. You made it. So they're gonna go there. Yeah, just push uh, them in. Six, they're gonna go boop, like that, or there. The halberd snakes. No double one to double one. Actually, they've already fought, so it's not a big deal yeah, if they don't yeah. make For it. For them, it's not, but it's nice to get that. You want to make sure you kill everything. Yeah, eight inches up. And everybody looks around, there's no cruel boys, except maybe a few hopgrats right here. Okay. Saving a command point for their inspiring presence, just so I can say they survive. I like it. I like it. All right, so um, who's not hunters of the Heartland? Uh, they're hunters. Are they? Uh, no, they're not hunters. Well, they're, they're not hunters either. Well, <sighs> I'm just gonna do something to one of them. Okay. I will. I will. I will. I don't know. I don't have any command points. So. Oh, okay. Who, so stop. Yeah. Who are you stopping? You know, one of them. The one that's probably better in close combat. Okay. Two mortal wounds. On a six up. And one dies and gets to fight. Yay! Does it get to fight right now? Like as soon it, as whenever they it die. dies. Yeah. It's not like dying in the combat. Correct. Phase. It's as soon as it's slain. So it, it didn't matter that I killed it. Selected to fight. So, so hitting on twos. So it's the wrong choice you're saying. And wounding on twos. So three 18? at rend one. And I don't even get to all at defense. It's one damage or is it just one damage? Okay. If I had mind razor, it'd be it'd be bigger. But that's my Zathai Kai like the actual like trait or whatever. So who's fighting? Combat phase. Uh, I'm gonna start with the Slaughter Queen. Four attacks on her. Yep, so four attacks. Uh, two's hit, two's to wound. Uh, with the plus one, plus one. Rend one. One damage each or? Uh, D3 each. Okay, go go ahead. Three D3. So that would be six. Six, six straight up die. I'm gonna, gonna leave the leader in, in there. Mm. Okay. Go. Let's have one last hurrah with my killer boss. He's yep. gonna attack the little Little battle sisters are gonna fight him anyways. Him on top. These these ones over here. Yeah yeah yeah. Um, oh sorry, all out attack. Yep. I made all three hits anyways with this mm -hmm. one, so I don't feel bad saying that now. Oh we don't know. He's not all attacking. He's saving for all of defense. Three's to wound. One wound at minus one. Okay, six up. 
That is a one. So it's two damage. So it uh, kills six one. Six ups. One. So you can just hold on to that, because obviously you get to keep fighting. Yep. The beaks only have three attacks now. Ooh, okay, well that works. How many? That's six, that's four mortal wounds, but we're not done yet. And nothing. Six Sixes. Ups. So nope. kill the rest of them. Yeah, so they just gonna swing at you. Yeah, all three of them get to fight when nope, they die. Nope. Uh, twos. And are you all out defending, I'm assuming? Oh yeah, I already said I was going yep. to. And twos. So that would be... Six of them? Six at rend one. And they're one damage each? Just one. Four up. Well, I got three wounds left. Nope, two wounds left. Yep. All right, Hobgratz. <laughs> Let's beat up this squad right no, here. No, no, that was in death. That was in death, yeah. So now it's, I your can... <laughs> <laughs> it's your turn. It's your turn. I'm going to go ahead and pick this unit right here. Normally, hot renders are fours and fours minus one in combat. Uh, so it's threes and threes. The sergeant gets an extra attack with both of its weapons, which is kind of cool, actually. I get no save. How much damage are they each? That is one damage each at minus one. Oh. So four. Oh, they're not that great. Not in... Yeah, I guess, I guess if they're pretty cheap, it doesn't matter. So four of them die. 95 points. For five? For five I with guess. one wound each. That's pretty expensive. It's very expensive. But yeah. what they do is they give me Hold on, great, they're one wound each? They're one wound each. They give me great screens. And... Well, I'll do these four. I guess the one that hasn't fought yet. Yep. Yeah, they're great screens. They're great screens. They get me lots of points, which is why you have to put them in there. And But you have, you're paying like quite heavily for them. Well, I got fours to hit. Uh, sixes do two hits. Nice. Oh, golly. Very nice. Oh, my. Now, so. they can bounce mortal wounds back at you with yeah, sixes. Whatever. Don't six. care. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. Don't <laughs> care. Got four wounds. So they do have a five up, and sixes bounce back a mortal. So, so three of them three die. They get to fight when they die, though. Oh, Your little more. guys do? No, no. Only my snakes get to die. Fight. Oh, okay. Like, yeah. So three go down, and you take a mortal wound. Well, you have a six up ward, don't you? Oh, I do. I do go down. And, ah. and one of mine die. Mm -hmm. All right, so it doesn't really matter with the hobgrass. I'm just going to remove them. So just try to hurt. See if you can kill my Ripa boss before I concede. Okay. Let's do <laughs> it. It's your last chance. going to honeycomb. And then yeah. I concede. Yeah, honeycombing them. I'm going to do the little blood worm first. Needs twos. And twos. Yeah. Rend? No rent on the Three blood up. worm. Ha-ha! How much damage? Just one. Okay, I got one wound left. <laughs> the little blood worm did some damage. Uh, these need twos and then... Need twos and then threes? Yeah, normally threes and fours. But because they are... Uh, inspired by the Slaughter Queen, sixes will be additional an additional hit. Three's doing this. Is your last chance to, to kill them. That's That's your last right. chance. Don't biff it. No rend on these. Yeah, well, I got a three up saves, so maybe they'll stay alive. Okay. Three up saves! Okay. I died! I got him! You got him! I got him! I got him! Inspiring presence. <laughs> I think I can concede at this point. You just got three victory points, two for your battle tactic, one for killing a monster. I did. And I've got four Hobgots left. Correct. Uh, but still, it's pretty close to what I thought. It's very, very close. It's really cool because then I've got blood, uh, Sisters of Daughters of Cain have one where two units can do a charge for battle tactic, which is another good one. Then you have behind enemy lines that get in your enemy's deployment. You can do the regular one, and then Daughters of Cain have another one that's the exact same thing, which oh, is golly. also really good. So they have a fantastic... I wish they, I wish they did it with the other ones because Orc War yeah. Clans have pretty... Poop. However, tactics. that was a great game, Matthew. Yeah. I can't wait to chat about a little bit about how it went in the post game. Let's go to the let's go to the post game. Yeah, right after this. And in the Mini War Gaming Vault, we have a special battle report here. It'll be the new Night Haunt Battle Tome against Fire Slayers. And it is also Friday the 13th today. So if you're not a vault member and you want to check out this game, all you have to do is click on the link down below and you can get yourself a seven-day free trial to the Mini War Gaming Vault. It's funny because uh, after that first round, I'm like, okay, I've totally lost this. And you did definitely have momentum the whole game. But in the end, was... like these things look scarier than they are, but they're only one wound each, so they die pretty easily. All you've got left is your one leader. A like this of is probably a, a this is like 400 points worth of snakes. I mean, like this is a chunk of my points. Of course, yeah, of course. But when you look at the table, at least it's not Correct. like because at this... first, at first, I was killing nothing, and then you brought everything back that I even managed to kill. But once Marathi went down, a lot of your synergy went away. Yeah, she's she's a very big part of making the list work. However. I'm really liking that that rally on a four plus. Oh yeah, on, that that's was huge. that's amazing. And the fact that you can do it in it, we haven't personally. I haven't used that mechanic in like any of the games that I've played, and uh, but now I understand the mechanic because we figured it out or I I learned. I think it's the biggest thing is that you realize you can do it on your opponent's turn. Yeah, and then on fours, it's great. Like being able to pull back those witches, even if you did take a, uh, like, in that case, you went, and then I was able to bring back that big block of and infantry, attack, yeah. and then they were ready to attack. And that's not something I've used ever. So I'm really liking that with the Doors yeah. of Cain. Marathi, though, you had the long-range shooting, so she was going down quickly almost 
regardless of what would happen. So you had to catapult So I her. had to go and kill them because those bows would have just... That's like, a mistake. That was a mistake yeah. of mine. I should have used one of these Hobgrout units. I should have put them, I should have deployed them right here, right in front of the monster. And then the first turn, I should have run them up. And then you would have had a harder time doing what you did there. Because I just had to pile in. I literally charged the yeah. monster that was closer and then just swung my base. Basically just keeping them alive a little longer. Yeah. Just to pop off a third shot, because they got two basically with the only shell. Mm -hmm. uh, and they did, they did very well for the shots yeah. that they made. So just having one more turn. And if I don't double turn you in that like, Second turn, like the, it, the game would have gone, would have probably flipped a little bit too. Yeah. Well, you know? at the very end there, yeah, yeah, when you still had your, what are they called? The uh, the sisters. Yeah, when they were yeah. all the way back here. Oh no, I, the renders. No, I, that that was one. I'm talking on the second turn. If you would have been able to, if I wouldn't have gone first, double turn to second, yes. because then Marathi doesn't double fight. Right. right. So then she doesn't she kill them. Kill them and Correct. kill the other guy too, yeah. or, the, or try to kill the other guy. Also, my snake. I love my snake. Oh, that's a great endless spell. <laughs> it's fantastic. Yeah, that's that's cool. I like I like how it has the monstrous interactions as well. So I like things. I, I want to try out the incarnate soon, see all those kind of cool interactions. Yeah. Well, we got a lot to kind of. You're going to be seeing a lot of the new daughters of Cain. So we're going to see how what Scary thinks of them as he goes through the different stuff and has, tries different armies. Can't wait to use a gladiatrix. Like I, this is the first time using a totem. That was really fun. Just having like an area around the table where I was like. Less damage, you know, potentially a crazy amount of attacks when they go nuts or like when it goes nuts. I love the Slaughter Queen, she was really good. And that Blood Rack Medusa is quickly becoming one of my favorite characters in this. That in was this a very list. powerful support character for yeah. sure. Mm -hmm. With a good offense as well capability. Yeah. Well, we'll definitely see more of that, more Daughters of Cain, more of the new Night Haunt, all that kind of fun stuff. What's so, the next project for you, Matthew? Like, you've been playing the Swamp guys for a while. I'll be probably switching back to Cities of Sigmar for a little bit, mm -hmm. try out some different combos in with there. With the new Sylvanas stuff? Yeah, for sure, oh, especially when the new Sylvanas so stuff exciting. comes out. I'm yeah. excited to see that. They previewed all that, and as a Sylvaneth player myself, I'm very, very excited to have different models and synergies to try out, like crazy flying beetles and like fairies with bows. It's gonna be great. It'll be great. I hope that you enjoyed that. Stay tuned for more Age of Sigmar Battle Reports and happy wargaming.